Welcome. This is the portal that leads to the world inhabited only by Pokemon. Beyond this gateway, many new adventures and fresh experiences await your arrival. Before you depart for adventure, you must first answer some questions. Be truthful when you answer them. That just immediately takes you right on back. Your friend offers to treat you to dinner. What do you do? Uh, I'm there. You've been invited to a wonderful party. It's time for the party to start, but there's nobody there. I mean, we're just waiting for people to show. Presumably, they're still gonna be there. <laughs> it's like, there's so much doubt here. It's like, what's wrong? <laughs> let's get this party started, let's go. You're about to buy a popular game when someone else gets the last copy. How do you feel? You <laughs> should just start crying. <laughs> Dropkick the child. Yeah, I'm kind of indifferent. Relax. Calm yourself. Now press the fingertip gently on the bow. Don't move your finger quite yet. Oh, sorry, sorry, hang on. Let's try that again. Your aura has now been identified. Your aura is... A vivid pink. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> Thank you for answering all those questions. You seem to be... A bold type. You're so brave and you never back down from anything, and you're also gutsy and brash in a way that others aren't. You know, you have the potential to become a truly great person. This will be the last one standing. Oh, jeez, like everyone else is dead. <laughs> so a bull type like you will be a Turtwig. We go with Turtwig. Choose the Pokemon you want for a partner. Oh, gods, so you just get to go through all of them, don't you? I think I want a fire one. So not Charmander. <laughs> Absolutely not Charmander. Okay. Bullpix friend. Yeah, what do we, what do we want to call him? <laughs> Just Firefox? No, we can't. You got you got to take it a bit more s s seriously. The Internet Explorers of the Sky. Oh God damn it! What? You're gonna ruin this game. You're gonna ruin this game. <laughs> You're gonna ruin it. Chapter one: A Storm at Sea. It's stormy. Are you okay? No. Don't let go. Just a little longer. Come on, hang on. That's it, that's the game, you immediately die. Don't uninstall me! Hey, you're finally awake. You're trying to cross the border as well. Just a couple of Nords. Can't drift enough. Immediately dies. Just collapsed. No, I refuse to be paralyzed by this any longer. This is it, today I'm going to be brave. I'm going to be your default internet browser. Pokemon detected, Pokemon detected. Whose footprint? Whose footprint? Footprint is Vulpix, the footprint is Vulpix. Nah, oh, it's too much, it's too much. Can't bring myself to go in. I vowed I would do it today, but... I thought that holding on to my personal treasure would inspire me. Just can't do it. Such a coward. This is so discouraging. Firefox has just given up on the world immediately. The little wimp was that was pacing around. Something good, right? Wimp had something, that's for sure. Looks like some kind of treasure. We go after it? We do. Hey, what's that? What's going on over there? Someone has collapsed on the sand. Do you have any idea how you ended up unconscious out here? I was unconscious. What happened? Anyway, I'm Mozilla Firefox. <laughs> what, you say you're a human? You look like a totally normal Turtwig to me. It's true. Turned into a Turtwig. How about your name? What's your name? My name, that's right, my name is... It It has to just be, like, Google Chrome now. Like, the. it's already been set in motion. <laughs> the emotional impact of this entire game has been immediately ruined. <laughs> Ouch! That's yours, isn't it? Oh, that's... Sorry, kiddo. We'll take that. You know, they're evil, because they're poison-type Pokémon. See you around, chicken. <laughs> it's my personal treasure, it means everything to me. If I lose that. No, there's no time to waste. I have to get it back. Say, could you please help me? What should I do? You don't have any time to waste, let's go. But you can't just, please, please help. <laughs> but I have amnesia. <laughs> just keep saying no. <laughs> Welcome to Beach Cave. After the stairway, as you go, you can attack enemies by pressing A. Enemies won't move or attack until you do. This is this is the gameplay of Mystery Dungeon. Basically, you're in a dungeon. Find the stairs at each floor. 
get to the next floor. It's the basic principle of every dungeon. A lot of Pokemon are basically going to attack you while you explore. Your goal is to just kind of keep progressing and not die. Actually, just try to get to the end. I'm curious if someone carved those stairs if they just appeared that way. <laughs> yeah, you know, there's like some like manky carpenters that are just at work in all the dungeons, you know? It's their day job. It's just what they do. It's just what they do here. Give me, give me back what you stole from me. That's my personal treasure. It means everything to me. Treasure, you say? That thing really is valuable, huh? I want to back that badly. Come and get it. Uh, I don't have much I can do other than just tackle them down. <laughs> just start beating up Coffin. Oh, he's he's really not strong. Okay. <laughs> they're, 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 they're right easing you in. Plastic, how do we get wiped out by wimps like them? Here you go, take it then. Happened only because you helped me, Chrome. <laughs> Thank you, Google Chrome. <laughs> See, I've always liked Legends and Lore. I always get so excited when I hear tales from the past. This fragment must fit into something somewhere. I want to discover what that is. I want to solve the mystery of my relic fragment. Earlier I tried joining an exploration team as an apprentice. But I was too cowardly. What about you, Chrome? What are you going to do now? You lost your memory. The browser history has just been deleted and lost to the void. Somehow you transformed into a Pokemon. We can make a good exploration team together, Chrome. So you do that with me. Please. It could just be so mean. <laughs> I am good. And so. Firefox and Chrome formed an exploration team. This turned out to be their very first step into the World Wide Web. Pokemon Company and Chunsoft presents Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky. Chapter 2, The New Guild Recruits. So Wigglytuff just looms over everyone. Like Dark Souls boss energy. Pokemon detect it, Pokemon detect it. Whose footprint? Whose footprint? Oh no, it is the internet! You may enter. Someone's with you. Get that stranger to stand up there. We need their feet as well! <laughs> footprint is... Footprint is... Um... Footprint is... Maybe Turtwigs. Maybe Turtwigs. But maybe... You don't seem to be bad. Okay, good enough. Enter. <laughs> Welcome to the foot dungeon. <laughs> oh god. It's like, wow, so this is DeviantArt! I'm Guildmaster Wigglytuff's right-hand Pokémon. Now, shoo, leave the premises. We have no time for salespeople or silly surveys. Off you go, if you please. No, that's not why we're here. We want to form an exploration team. We came here. We want to get proper training as an exploration team. Well, well, well. Wish you had told me up front that you want to be an exploration team. I feel like we're joining, like, a pyramid scheme. Now, here we are at Guildmaster Wigglytuff's chamber. On no account. I repeat, on no account. Should you be discourteous to our guildmaster? He will destroy you. Guildmaster. Um, guildmaster? Hiya! I'm Wigglytuff. I'm the guild's guildmaster. You want to form an exploration team? Let's go for it. First, we must register your exploration team's name. Tell me your team's name. It, it's never gonna fit, is it? <laughs> Internet E. <laughs> team search bar. <laughs> that works. <laughs> Just team search bar. <laughs> we will search and rescue you in these labyrinths of the internet. Registered, registered, all registered. Yumta. Congratulations. Now on, you're an official exploration team. We present you with this in commemoration. There's an explorer badge inside, and a wonder map, and a treasure bag. Thank you. Do our best. Yep, but you're only apprenticing right now, so do your best to train. We will. Always do our best, Chrome. Gonna search and explore the internet. I'm suddenly apprentice at the guild. Gotta admit, it's pretty exciting to be an exploration team. It's fun to be friends with Firefox. First things first. Who am I? How did I turn into a Pokemon? How did I end up unconscious on that beach? Why is everyone asking for feet here? Rise and shine. Come on, snap out of it. Not about to get in trouble because you rookies got a plate. Get it in gear. You're in the military now. Snorful. Guildmaster Wigglytuff never ceases to amaze me. Hey, you got that right. Looks like he's wide awake. His eyes are wide open, but he's fast asleep. Thank you, sir. We all value your words of wisdom. Okay, Pokemon, take our Guildmaster's words of wisdom to heart. Finally, let us not forget our morning cheers. All together now. A one, a two, a one, two, three. One, don't shirk work. Two, run away and pay. Three, smiles go for miles. Hey, Pokemon, get to work. Hooray. Wigglytuff is still asleep. Don't forget. 
Snorful. I, I, that, that's like the most motivational quote of the entire game right there, you know? Can I have like, like a, have like a sky, like a picture of the sky, like transparent PNG of Wigglytuff. Just don't forget. Snorful. It's the job bulletin board. Pokemon from various regions post job requests here. You're aware that bad Pokemon are cropping up in greater, no greater numbers, yeah, right? Yep. As the flow of time is getting messed up. Wrecking havoc, right? Which is why lots of bad Pokemon are appearing. Also in a mass outbreak of mystery dungeons. Mystery dungeons? You know, I got my relic fragment back yesterday. The place where we found it was a mystery dungeon. The mystery dungeon changes each time you go into it. Different layout and different items every time you enter. Jobs all take place in mystery dungeons. So, let's look for a job you should perform. Hello, my name is Spoink. An outlaw has run off my most prized possession, my precious pearl. A pearl is life itself to me. Just can't seem to sell down if that pearl is in its proper place atop my head. Oh, friendly readers, would you be so kind as to go to the bluff and get my pearl? Beg your help, exploration team members. From Spoink. Be forced out of a dungeon and sent back here if either of you faints. You lose half your money. You can lose half your items and more. You best be careful. It's nice that they only nick half your wallet. I'll give him some change for the bus home, you know? Don't take, don't take everything. Let's see the bluff's entrance. Swing's mission description said the pearl's deep down on the basement floor 7. Will your partner be smart teammate by tweaking its IQ skills and tactic settings? Oh, I remember this. Like, let's go together, go after foes, avoid the first hit. You unlock more options as time goes on. Forgot about that. Firefox's own version of AI. <laughs> Here's the pearl. Must be Swing's pearl. Quick, let's take it back. Pearl wants to be propped in my head, you see. I miss it so much. Just couldn't settle down without it up there. It was just boinging and sproinging everywhere. <laughs> sproinging. <laughs> Next to you, that long nightmare is over. My sincere thanks. You're also given 2,000 Pokémon. Incredible. Wow, 2,000. We can have all this money. Of course, of course, there's nothing compared to my Pearl's value. Farewell. Now hand that money over, if you please. Excuse me. Most of the money from jobs goes to the guildmaster, you see. Your team's share of the money comes out to this much. Huh? We only keep 200? It is a pyramid scheme. Oh, look at this chrome. There are posters up here that show a variety of Pokemon. Oh, they all look sort of cool. They're famous explorers. Pokemon posted here are outlaws. They're all shady characters. They're wanted for committing crimes. This is the dark web board. There are also bad Pokemon who are merely petty thieves. We've got evil to naughty and everything in between. I'm sure we can avoid giving you a job catching a super bad Pokemon. He's like off the bat, bat, it's like your first target is Groudon. He caused an earthquake the next town over. Good luck. These are the new recruits that just joined us. They can show them around the town. Like, I mean, Badoof absolutely has to have a goofy voice. Like, there's, there's no question. Like, it fits so- Yes, sir. My golly. I'll do just that. Yup, yup. Like, there, there's literally no way. It fits too well. This is the main square for the local Pokemon. It's called Treasure Town. I can tell you about Treasure Town too. But over there is Duskull Bank. You can save your money there. This is the Kecleon Market. You can buy and sell items here. And there's Kangaskhan Storage. Items stored here will never be lost. The precious items that you can't afford to lose, store them here before you go on an adventure. Alright, then come find me when you're all ready to go. I'll give you a help and add what's selected the right outlaw for you. We got a lot of criminals to choose from. Gosh, I'm just excited thinking about it. Murderers, criminals, capitalists. We have so many! Marilyn Azuropod and Apple at Kecleon Market. Thank you, uh, Mistress Kecleon. It was an extra apple. We didn't pay for this many. Oh yes, that, young friends, is a gift from me and my brother. Please share it among yourselves and do enjoy. Really? Okay, thank you, Mr. Kecleon and Mr. Kecleon. <laughs> oh, not to worry, my friends. Do take care on your way home. It must be quite confusing for, like, Pokémon of, like, the same species, yeah. Because, like, this is Kecleon. This is also Kecleon. Youch. Sorry, the body. Thank you so much. Rome gave the apple back to Azuro. Then suddenly... Oh, what was that? Help. Something the matter. Hey, Azuro. What's going on? Hurry home. Yep, I'm coming. Wait up. I'm sure nothing bad's gonna happen. What's happening? Oh, hi. Some time ago, we lost an item that's pretty important to us. We've been looking all over. We haven't found it yet. And Mr. Drowsy came along, and he says he may have seen our lost item somewhere. He even offered to help us look for it. I'm so happy about this. Is that right? How nice for you. Thank you, Mr. Drowsy. Oh, please. I have a cold heart to ignore kids in need. I can't turn a blind eye. Let's be on our way to begin our search. Yep. Yep. 
Whoops, excuse me. Keep being difficult will mean big trouble for you. Help. What a nice young man we ran into in the street. But you described us sound like an emergency, but it's not like I don't trust you, Chrome, but I just can't believe it. After all, Drowsy seemed to be a sincerely nice Pokemon, didn't he? I thought of three of them go off together earlier. Looked like they were having a good time, didn't they? But he looks so nice. Like, I'm sure there's nothing suspicious going on here. Marrow Brothers are in incredible danger, meanwhile. Thanks to Vulpix, those Marrow Brothers are gonna be on a true crime podcast. Just advice for life to like play a caution. It's like you don't want to end up on a podcast. You gotta be like they'll be talking about you. And you know, the podcast might be sponsored too. Like you don't want your door you, like the discussion of your debt to be sponsored by NordVPN. Let's be real here. It's Drowsy. He's a wanna criminal. If the hurry, Azura will be in trouble. What happens if it's like the same species of Pokemon? Just thinking about it. Like, what if you're just a different Drowsy? And you're just immediately arrested. <laughs> After we all left, we went looking for our lost home together. I wound up all alone when Mr. Drowsy went somewhere with Azuro. He called and called, but they didn't come back. I got scared. Which way did they go? That way. It's time to search and save you. <laughs> it's like search for a result. <laughs> How do we want to phrase it? Oh! We don't have many move options at the moment. Almost actually died. Sorry, kiddo. You lost item. It's not here. That's for sure. Huh? My big brother. My big brother's following us, right? He's coming soon. Nope. Your big brother's not coming. I'll tell you in a little secret. This was all a trick. I deceived you. Oh, I forgot about this meme. <laughs> Let's not dwell on that. There's a little favor I need to ask. See that hole behind you? Well, there's a rumor that there's a trove of teeth treasure inside there. As you can see, I'm too big to square my way through that hole. That's where you come in. Don't worry, just do as I say. Do that, then I'll help you get back out of here. But, go on, get going. Go into that hole, don't forget to bring back the treasure. Stop right there. Safe search. Brought to you by Team Search Bar is here to rescue you. No criminal could escape us. You're but one click away. Okay, so how this fight is gonna go. We, we have inventory, we really just wanna use it. Uh, this causes wild hallucinations, so you chuck it at him. Oh no. Uh, okay, well, we could stun him. Then we can eat the blast seed. 35 damage. But there goes most of our, of our special inventory. We'll just have to beat him down from here. He's intent on making sure Firefox is asleep forever. We're gonna lose our seed as well. Because he was standing on it. <laughs> Firefox needs a U-block install. It's like, oh no, intrusive ads! <laughs> The greatest criminal of all! I've been able to arrest a wanted outlaw. But you great thanks for your cooperation. We'll send a reward to your guild. Thank you again. Going away for a long time. Exploration Team Federation has sent a message. Rome's team was rewarded with an enlarged treasure bag. You now carry more items than you could before. Wait, there's one more message. Special episode Bidoof's Wish has been unlocked. So special episodes are unique to this game for the Explorers uh, series. Uh, basically, it's its own kind of self-contained story. And we got one for Bidoof. 3,000 Pokémon bounty that was on the head of the captured outlaw. However, there's 2,700 of that is the guild's share. That portion was withheld. As a result, Chrome's team received only the remaining 300. <laughs> it's actually like a pyramid scheme. I was getting messed up bit by bit all over the world. No one seems to know why. We're closer to 2040 now than we are at the year 2000. I'm not sure what's happening there. Everyone believes that the Time Gears are somehow involved. Huh? Time Gears? They say Time Gears are hidden in secret places around the world. Time Gears serve a very important function. Each one protects time and keeps time flowing properly in its region. But my guess is that if a Time Gear is removed from a region, the flow of time in that region will probably stop too. I'm sure, sure nothing bad is happening right now. My eyes deceive me. Could it be? Yes, it is. I finally found it. Who could this Pokemon possibly be? Look closely, it's Jigglypuff from above. It's Safari. <laughs> oh, you headed to the beach. Oh, would you keep an eye out for something if you could? Recently, there have been bottles washing up on the beach. Looks as though there's something inside those bottles. That sounds interesting, you might want to look for bottles on the beach. Oh, okay. Yeah, here's one. Looks like there's something inside. Would you like to try and take it out? Delivered cherry berry. 
Your job list is full, so you cannot add it. Do we just ch toss it back into the ocean if it's full? I don't think we want to do that. You just toss it back into the ocean if you can't help him. Like, that guy is just dead. <laughs> He's on his own. How desperate was that Pokemon too for that berry? Like that's their only way to even request it. Like they like Amazon is not an option in this world. There's like no shop they could have gone to. It's like please. Berry berries heal paralysis. He wasn't going anywhere. Oh no, that's why. <laughs> He's actually stuck. <laughs> We're doing sentry duty today. Sorry, I'm usually the one to do sentry duty. Today my dad gave me his duty of up updating the boards. I can't mind my post. Great if someone could take over my set. My sentry duty for today. While you're here, please do a good job for me. Bye. I didn't follow that at all. How did we get involved in this? Shut your yap. <laughs> all you two have to do is inspect the footprints of visitors and tell me what Pokemon they are. You're really gonna learn, like, the different feet of Pokemon in this game <laughs> because of this. Uh, Venusaur? It's like, you're right. He's a true gamer. He knows his feet. <laughs> We got it right, we got it right. I mean, uh, that, that has to be a Taurus. <laughs> got them all. Perfect. Actual experts. Worked an honest day, you two. Let me review your sentry duty performance. What on earth is in your search history? Work for jo job, perfectly done, Chrome's team. 500, a joy seed, and a life seed. That, that, that's some amazing rewards, just for me. Like, that's probably the best reward in the game so far. It pays to know your feet. Look at that feet pays board and save it an abducted child. <laughs> it actually did. Yeah, that's... It says a lot about our society. Chapter 5, the first official exploration. Everyone listen up, I have an important announcement to make. Farther to the northeast and f farther into its outermost reaches, there lies a place named Tree Shroud Forest. The tree Shroud, Shroud, Shroud Forest? Time has apparently stopped. Two drops and leaves won't fall. They just hang there, suspended. Tree Shroud Forest time itself has truly stopped. That's because Tree Shroud Forest time gear was stolen. Huh? Time gear was stolen. But made time stop. Hey, hey, hey! Gorefish always speaks like this, so just get used to it. Doesn't matter how severe the situation is, it's gonna be a hey, hey, hey! I'm feeling depressed today. Hey, hey, hey! Alright, everyone here's to another busy day of work. Hooray! <laughs> We're just back to like our jolly mood immediately. Treasure Town is here. And over here is where we would like you to investigate. By all appearances, is just an ordinary waterfall. We received intelligence that the waterfall may conceal a secret. And that's where you come in. We want you lot to investigate the waterfall and determine what's there. There's always the secret behind the waterfall. Any good game. Quickly, check the Twitter account. This is the waterfall. It's supposed to have a secret. Ah! Water's pounding down. We're getting close to the waterfall crumb. It's true. This is incredible. I'm in incredible pain now. I, I wonder which Pokemon that is. Actually, Jigglypuff from above is very close, I think. It's a hidden cave behind this waterfall. We have to go beyond the firewall. Immediately dies. You're right after all, Chrome. Go explore this cave. From the cave.com. Very underground website. Oh, they want to join. We can start getting team members. I don't I don't know which who we're gonna keep on the team just yet. But we'll try and give them like appropriate names. Yeah, so this this one has to be Vine. Like this is literally no other name for it. Uh Lotad's not a bad one. We can take them all on the team if we can. Yeah, this this could just be AOL. AOL the Lotad. Oh, I've never seen a gem this immense. This is an incredible treasure. Everyone will be amazed if we take this back. <laughs> it's so suspicious. <laughs> Who's even looking around here? White Fox just happened to push the gigantic gem. That's... What have you done? Will is like 20 like spam adverts loads. Like what website is this? Where are you taking us? Oh, it's a flood! Hey, hey, you two okay? Flopped down from nowhere. Oh, you startled everyone. This is the hot spring. Hot spring? Indeed, this is the hot spring. Hot spring works wonders on tired muscles and creaky joints. Many Pokemon visit here. The hot spring wash away your fatigue before you make your way home. Yeah, we have a hell of a commute now. 
complete like opposite end of the world. Where's AOL? I think AOL was just standing off to the side in that cutscene. They just they just punched the hot spring. They didn't want to go in. Low Tout is not allowed in the hot springs. <laughs> Don't let him in. Not that one. We've had trouble. This is a major discovery. Really? Undoubtedly. After all the presence of the cave behind the waterfall. No one knew about that before now. Oh, I see. We made a discovery. Don't think so. That shape. I've seen that shape before. That was... Wigglytuff! Arden, you're saying Wigglytuff may have gone to that waterfall before? No, no, emphatically no. That's inconceivable. If that was so, the Guildmaster wouldn't have ordered you to investigate the place, right? I asked the Guildmaster, he molded over for a bit. And he said, Oh memories, sweet memories. Yumta. And he danced around a bit. And then he said, Yes, yes, when I think hard, maybe I did go there once. That's just what the Guildmaster said. <laughs> Sum it up, it's just as Chrome suspected. He's indeed already been to Waterfall Cave. Oh, okay, that's kind of disappointing. Really thought we'd discover a new place. I wish Wigglytuff had told us right from the start. What a waste of everyone's time. We didn't even discover the hot spring. There were Pokemon already there. Yet we found, like, a worse way to get to that hot spring. <laughs> like, that's the thing. Oh, like, if you navigate the treacherous labyrinth, and, like, it, the cave will drown you for, like, an hour, and then you'll wash up at the spring. Basically, like, like the, the replacement bus service to get to the hot spring. I noticed something about your dizzy spells, Chrome. That always seem to happen when you're touching something. I think about Firefox is right. This could be something totally amazing. You could use it in lots of ways. Not just for exploring, either. The ability could be useful for many things. It's amazing, Chrome. Is access to the way forward machine. <laughs> It's not even the way back machine anymore, it's the way forward as well. <laughs> See what this page will look like in 20 years. Plan them out a full expedition soon. Expedition? To go, go explore someplace far away. I tried and explored a nearby area. So we need to prepare for the big trip properly. Carefully choose which guild members go on the expedition. There's still time before we set out on the expedition. If you fail to do good work before then, you cannot be ex you cannot expect to be selected. I'm sure you two can do it. Try hard. Bring us in copious amounts of profit and only receive a 10% cut as we take the lion's majority. Straight criminal. Wigglytuff has those cold, dead eyes. Hey. You two. A duo. Why haven't we seen them before? They tried to mug me. Don't take what I'm about to say the wrong way. You just forget about being an exploration team. What? Why? You're timid. You scare easy. Scaredy cat like you can't cut it on an exploration team. But... It's true that I'm timid. That's why I'm in training, so I can overcome my own shortcomings. Even now, I'm working hard to be picked for the guild's expedition. Oh, what expedition do you say? No! Oh no, you've given the game away, Firefox! Team Skull, our exploration team has three members. Chief is incredibly talented. But bluntly, he's brutally tough. If Chief were around, we'd snap you like a twig. It's like the bumbling music immediately starts. Move! Out of the way! <laughs> oh, Chrome! What's this awful stench? It smells like rotten cheese. It is foul, yes siree. Hey, hey, my eyes are burning. <laughs> Move it! <laughs> you wanna end up like that wimp over there? What, an expedition from this guild? <laughs> it does sound tasty. Get out of here, need to do some plotting. Come on, we're going. He just came in here. Let out an awful fart, and is just running away. Oh, the cafe's open. Customer, is it not? Good day, is it not? The new shop Spindus Cafe is now open. Wonderful shop is overflowing with hopes and dreams, is it not? Hopes and dreams. That's right. Hello, and welcome to Spindus Cafe. My name is Spinda, I am the owner of this cafe. No. Doubtly collected gummies and apples during your explorations, am I right? Here those edibles can become delicious drink sensations. I spend it will take your ingredient and use my incredible skills to create a delectable drink for you. Oh, it's a bar! It's the centerpiece of our place, the recycle shop. You have a bunch of items in storage that you've picked up in your travels and have little use for them, right? Sometimes you have to throw out your extra items to make room. Doesn't that seem wasteful? There will be explorers and dungeons out there who are desperately in need of the very things you have locked in storage. That's what we thought too, that's why we established this facility. So the question is, what kind of pyramid scheme is this also going to be? Shake it this way, shake it that way. Stir it all around and it's done. Light rich flavor that just melts in your mouth. 
Okay, IQ goes up from this too, does it? Here's your prize ticket. You want to redeem that prize ticket for a prize now? Please select a color card. Red, blue, or yellow? Right, red. Is it a win? Is it not? So it is a win or not? That's right. Is it? It's so great. Why not take your prize? Oh, we did win. We got a defense scarf. Okay. Just try get. Lotad's already died. <laughs> Holy YouTube. Oh, there goes one reviver seed. It's a brutal start. He's got the spirit. His heart's in the right place. Oh, wanted outlaw spot it. Okay, uh, did I bring any stun seeds? No, that was really stupid of me. Special defense rose, that's... Oh my god, it's doing nothing now. Thank god. We got enough early damage on it, we're alright. No, 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 Machop! Oh, don't, 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 don't do that. Don't, don't. Come down here. You gotta be really careful. If they do that, like, they're dead. This guy's so strong. Oh my god. Wait, no, this is, this is the outlaw. Okay, alright, get the gag in position. <laughs> He's doing so much damage. I'm just gonna have to tackle down. <laughs> where, where did he go? Oh, there's a shop here, though. Oh no. <laughs> Everyone's so injured. Let's see how many missions we can complete. Fight for your life, gang. Oh, thank God. One HP Machop. That's so bad. The game's like, uh-oh. I'm, I'm hoping we can drop off. Actually, I don't know if we want to drop off Machop before we have to fight this next guy. He's here. And there's, there's a Psyduck on its way, too. <laughs> hey, get in the position, gang. Roar is being shockingly useful. <laughs> no, we keep getting out of position. Growl's actually not bad here. Thank god, he was just being stupid. You've been getting so lucky. <laughs> I know. Don't worry, I know. 3,000 Pokémon. 300. That's 60 points. Oh, we are, we are, we are on feet inspection again today. I mean, this is great. This this pays so much more. I was using extended swords. Oh, okay, it's Gallade, is it? You're getting meaner. Yeah, we're good. Try to keep you waiting. Firefox and Chrome. That'll do when I get back here. Feet perfection. We know our toes. Common RT foot assessment. 300. Defense scarf. Reviver seed. Like, the rewards are- these are better than the actual missions. Oh no. Cheese is back. There's some kind of foul stench. Doof looks excited by that. These three aren't joining us as apprentices. We join our expedition to lend us their assistance. Pardon, why are you so shocked? Ah, yeah, sir, it's nothing. That one there likes to overreact to every little thing. Oh. Alrighty then. That seems okay. We decided that having this trio take part will make us stronger on the expedition. Ever it would be impossible to coordinate teamwork if we were to begin working together right away. If we decided that the trio should live with us for several days. Only be for a short while, I ask everyone to treat our guests with hospitality. You gotta be kidding, this stinks that he's making us to be cheerful when... What? Yum. Yum. No! The Guildmaster! His rage is building! The Guildmaster gets angry, it'll be horrific! Everyone, come on! Be cheerful even if it hurts! Alright everyone, let's get down to today's work! Hooray! Everyone is terrified. Please, Wooper, join our team. Oh! We got him. Could this be our Microsoft Edge? The right color scheme. Edge has joined Team Search Bar to go on adventures. Oh no, I think that's the outlaw. Edge, you gotta get away. This is a really bad spot to fight him. Oh my god! Thank god for that. Alright, the guild members have all gone off the bed. Go find it now. I'll find what? What else? The guild's food stock. Find their food and give ourselves a proper feast. 
<laughs> just literally stealing. We inspected the ladder this morning. For some mysterious reason, the guild's food stock has dropped sharply all of a sudden. From our entire stock of perfect apples has disappeared. That was the only item to get completely cleaned out. Or that they had the guild master's favorite food. There were no perfect apples. The guild master would kill us all. You need to bring him his dinner the way he likes it. Please don't fail. Those apples are all that's keeping the demons at bay. Howdy, welcome to the Electrovire Link Shop. Link all the moves you want for just 500 a session. Basically, if you link a move, when you select it, you'll do like a double action. So if I was to link like, um, like tackle and absorb, then if I click that, it uses both moves instantly. There's some combinations of moves that are significantly better than others to do this with. And there are some combinations that are very powerful. At the moment, I don't think there's anything that we really need to link. Wait till we get like a TM move or something. Scanner orb. Okay, one more gamble, one more gamble, hang on. I actually don't have a lot of items to put in at the moment. Put in the big apple. Just one more, guys, I swear. Let's keep getting scanner orbs. Nah, it's not worth it. Nice, you traded four pieces of trash for one piece of trash. Total items on this floor, what? Why did you tell me that? I think we got it as well. Oh, it's the sniffer IQ skill, is it? Firefox sniffed the floor out. Total items on this floor, four. She's sniffing. Firefox just does that now. It's like, I need to have you open the browser. It's like, hey. Seven. Hey. You left a tab open. I think the sniffing ability helps with the feet mini game. I see. I see you're asking the important questions. Trying to access the guild? <sniffs> it's a Pikachu. Must be perfect apples. Edge is just gonna appear in a lot of the cutscenes now too. Like they're they're just along for the adventure. But you, I'm Skull at your service. You wondered how you could get the perfect apples. Then could be easier. Watch. It's gonna attack the tree. Some perfect apples. Hey, what'll I tell you? Come on now, scoop those up. Scoop them up and scuttle back. Clearly a trap. What's the matter, aren't you gonna pick them up? I was so nice that I helped you out. You're gonna pull another dirt, dirty trick, aren't you? You won't fool me again. How boring is that? I knew it. <laughs> we were just gonna, like, mug you again. <laughs> Knock out your team, then we're taking the perfect apples back to our guild. Be, uh, they're probably, like, a bit unnerved uh, by Wooper at this point. Who's just been... Eerily quiet. <laughs> Just staring at them. If you can withstand this attack. Coffin and I will use our noxious gas combo. <laughs> they just took them all immediately. That was awful. Oh, where are the perfect apples? They're gone. Let's bullies eat them all. They're all gone. There's nothing we can do. Can't do anything else. Let's go back to the guild. I'm sorry, Wigglytuff. We could only find Granny Smith. Just hear the sound of like a gun being cocked. It's like, no, Wigglytuff, please! Leave me no choice. For the time being, you'll go without dinner tonight. What, but? You failed to complete an important job. The punishment could be much more severe. Hiya, you brought me some perfect apples, didn't you? Thank you. Uh, it's slight. Probably hard to say this, but. Oh, what's wrong? See, uh, truth be told, it's apprentices, where they failed in their mission to bring back any perfect apples, and. Well, to put it another way. Okay, I understand. It's all right. Nobody wins all the time. Don't feel blue, don't feel blue. Where are the other perfect apples? As I explained, um, they failed to get them, so, uh... In other words, uh, the perfect apples... The perfect apples harvested would be, uh... Zero. <laughs> Sniffle. Sniffle. Sob. Oh, he's gonna cry. Ah! Everyone get down, there's fallen rocks! Cover your ears! Ah! Oh no! The place is caught up in smoke! Sorry to disturb you, we've come to deliver a perfect apple. Huh? Please accept as a token of our friendship. Oh wow, you went and got it just for me. Yay, thank you friends, friends. I want to push Scud Tank off a cliff. Jesus Christ. Murder. <laughs> Stole our apples? You die now. <laughs> you can actually auto-generate custom levels for this. For whatever reason, these codes you see at the bottom of the Wonder Mail, they determine all the conditions with it. 
And there is a website that actually lets you write these yourself. Uh, just to demonstrate it, I actually just generated a code that automatically gives you a Marie in on the first floor of Beach Cave. And it's kind of wild that you can just do this. I, 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 I had no idea this existed until people pointed it out in the Discord. Uh, you can straight up just do this so you can get like, uh, like a Dragonite or something like that from the very start of the game. Like, it's actually absurdly broken. <laughs> Um, but I thought just for funsies, I'd generate one where we just pick up a Mareep. Because we love Mareep. Your failure yesterday weighs heavily. <laughs> you didn't get the Granny Smith at the store. As you know, it is difficult to tell what our Guildmaster is thinking from his demeanor. There's no doubt that he must be seething with anger inside. <laughs> when the time comes to announce the members, don't get your hopes up. That's all. Like, no one understands how Wigglytuff works. I'm a doof. My golly, not- not so loud! We're plotting a coup to overthrow the guild! We need all the help we can get! I've hidden the weaponry required for this task! We strike at sundown, men! We all set aside a little bit of our dinners last night for you. Now, eat up. If they all set aside a bit of their dinners, how is there two apples when there's three of them? I appreciate the gesture, don't get me wrong. Someone didn't set aside, like, jack shit. Every one of us needs to be able to work hard in order to be picked for the expedition. Yup, yup. Thanks, everyone. At the expedition, Kana just came and told us. Probably not going to be chosen. How could you say that? There's no telling what might happen. No siree? Who knows how much blood will be shed later tonight? And everyone wants to go on the expedition with you. Mozilla Firefox and Google Chrome. Everyone, honestly, thank you. We don't want to be stuck here with AOL again. We've been fortunate to have so many wonderful customers. This shop's pride and joy. The recycle shop is fully operational and has collected many items. We'd like to thank you for your kind patronage. By opening a new service. Calling it Project P. Don't laugh, gang. You might be wondering how Project P fits into all of this. I feel like I'm just being pitched like the new iPhone or something. Like spin this just like Steve Jobs up on the stage right now. That's not all we have to show you today. We'd like to unveil a new product in the Spinda Cafe that's really gonna change the way you interact with Spinda Cafe. Basically, here's my business plan. Dragons, please invest in me. Project Pyramid Scheme. <laughs> Basically, we gotta rescue Crumpet from the cave. I mean, this this one's just gonna be Crumpet, I feel. I don't know if we're necessarily even gonna use Crumpet, but I just I just wanted to find her. Bless you, Crumpet. There she goes. Exploration team, run! Oh, he's 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 not gonna go quietly. He's fleeing the scene. <laughs> You're going away a long time, Tangela. Okay, oh, we don't need to pick up any more items. Okay, okay, we just want to get Crumpet on the team. I don't think this should affect the game's balance, balance like, too significantly, honestly. I think we're close to where we get Mareep anyway. Ah, oh, look at the team! Quite a colorful bunch, ain't it? Oh, there's a silver ticket now. Oh, we can get- it's like Gamble Plus. I'm so glad they added Gamble into this game. Oh, you have no idea. But people get sentimental for different reasons. This is what I wanted. This is what I always wanted. That's- that's all we got. Okay, now we got double or nothing. Oh, we got a big win. Double or nothing, like... 90% of gamblers, gamblers quit before they win big. He all hit- oh. That's kind of bad, though. The lesson here, always keep gambling. Do it again until you win big. I'm gonna have no inventory left at this rate. Okay, I want to go sightseeing. That's an unfortunate one on all of these awful ones of people getting mugged. <laughs> you do kind of have to wonder what's going on with, like, the random wild Pokemon in these places. Like, are they all just criminals just trying to mug people? Oh, Machop just wanted to be, like, dropped off here. It's like, that's my stop. It's a weird place to want to go, isn't it? We got we got w one more criminal to get to apprehend. That's rock. Oh, but it's bug as well. Jesus Christ. Well, that's bad. Perfect, use Roar. Use Roar. Jesus Christ, Adderit! Oh, great, he changed his target. <laughs> We're just dead. That wasn't so good, it's harder than I thought. Let's go home for the day. But god damn it, that's really bad. The other missions are just counted as failed. Alright, well, we're not, we're not fighting you again. <laughs> Problem is, we didn't have enough gummies. You know, any, any, anyone can tell. We're just gonna get one little gambling, okay? Just one. Yeah, we've always won the times that we've gone red. Oh, wait, don't tell me. Is it a big win? Don't tell me. It's a loss, right? That's right. Oh. 
Wooper just fell over. Three more time gears remain. I must have them. Pikachu's at it again. It's like, goddamn Pikachu. You can never escape him. They gotta insert into the franchise no matter what. That's just a long Pikachu there. That's all that's happening. Now then. So there's the expedition members at this time. Our first member. Loudred. Yes, I did it. Next up is Corfish. Hey, hey, got it. Well, this is a surprise. Our next member is Bidoof. Really, really, a truly. Golly, me. I'm going on the expedition. The HM slave. <laughs> hey, Bidoof, you need to use, like, strength, cut, like, surf, and you're just gonna slap flash on you, too. We're just gonna chuck you at, like, every boulder in our way. There you go. So we have Sunflora and Chimeco. Oh, us too. Eek, oh my gosh. It appears there are more expedition members. The others are Diglett, Doug Drio, and Crow Gunk. Oh, and Firefox and Chrome. That is all. Wait a second, what? <laughs> Guildmasters, this seems to include every member of the guild. Yup, that's right. Everyone went. It will be more fun. What? It will be noisy and excited and having fun. I started thinking about it and it made me so excited I couldn't sleep. How is this business staying afloat all these years? Golly, I'm mighty happy that they even let me go on this here expedition. Which is me, why everyone gets to go. Like I'm dreaming, it's making me mighty emotional. Quiet HM slave. Your use is to break the boulders, Badoof. Don't get any ideas. Here's the objective. Exploration of Fogbound Lake. Fogbound Lake. Right, is the lake said to be located far to the east? However, it is perpetually enshrouded by a dense fog. As such, its actual existence has never been confirmed. It's merely the foggy mirage of a spot that lives to this day on rumor alone. It's also rumored a treasure of exquisite beauty is hidden there. A treasure, we're going on a treasure hunt. The strategy is to split up into several groups to travel to the base camp. That means if you die along the way, you're on your own. The guild's expedition party began making its way toward Fog Van Lake. According to plan, the party was split into the designated groups. Chrome, Firefox, and Badoof's group plotted its course. Religious crusade time. If you haven't heard of Badoof, you're gonna hear of him soon. And this is looking more and more like a true expedition. I can't wait to establish a church here. The closer here, there are two entrances. That's mighty vexing. What do we do, Chrome? Which way should we go? So, if you pick side path, you simply have to do this again. The correct answer is Craggy Coast. The correct answer is the one with the unique name, otherwise you just wind up back here again. So, take a wild guess which is the correct path, and which will send you back here. I'll let you poll it, yeah, poll it. I'm, I'm gonna make this very clear. The correct way, the wrong one. It's already a landslide, it's like 70% to go the wrong way. There's more votes than people here, hang on, what's going on there? You can spend a hundred points. Oh, okay. There's voter fraud. It's a sham election. Okay, we're just gonna go bolt. We're gonna go bolt. Go rock that. The music even changes just to indicate that you have gone the incorrect way. They don't even give much XP, which is what people were saying it would be good to do this pat for. And it's over. That's it. Pull it again. Why, why are you voting for this? Like, we're not gonna progress the game. It might have a different end. <laughs> oh my god, we found an apple. I made it all worthwhile. They don't even say anything, and your partner just turns to you. It's like, please select Mount Horn next time. Get a mod, set up another pull. <laughs> um, so your options are now the correct way, and the correct way. Oh my god, you've actually bounced it so there's like only a vote in the difference. It's like quickly, we need the coin flip to land equally. If it if it is an equal amount each side, I will I will do rock bat again. There's no way. There's no way you'll get it. There's it's just not possible. It was one away. <laughs> it's actually very close. One person who did not vote caused this. I hate it. <laughs> Democracy has worked against itself this time. Groudon's heart. That's a bit ominous. <laughs> You're all late. Everyone else arrived a long time ago. Set your equipment down. Make haste. And everyone's assembled. Let's get on with our strategy briefing. Right, wait a second. I know this place. Have I been here before? Maybe. This is something to do with me before I lost my memory. Born to the legend, Fogbound Lake is the home to a Pokemon named Uxie. 
Pokemon is said to be exceedingly rare. So he is said to lock eyes with others and wipe their memories clean. What? Wipe their memories clean? That is why even if travelers were to happen upon Fogbound Lake, Uxie would wipe their memories clean, thereby muzzling the travelers from revealing the existence of the lake. Don't worry, everything will be all right. Let's believe in success for this adventure too, and let's try, let's try. Wigglytuff is just gonna like, like, stomp his foot on the ground and crack open the earth itself and reveal the like. Stop spoiling, I... <laughs> Yeah, like, like, Arceus is actually gonna, like, appear in the game at some point, and Wigglytuff is just gonna, like, snap his fingers. You should have gone for the head, Yumta. No! <laughs> okay, I'll take a wild guess, which is the correct path to go. It's like some kind of stone, I guess. Red and pretty, it's kind of like a gem, actually. Wow, it feels warm. The heat's coming from inside the stone, it's weird. It doesn't seem to be lava, what could it be? It could be rare, I'll keep it. How did the rest of the groups miss that? The other groups went down the right path. <laughs> they all went forest path, you think? <laughs> We're the only ones to pick the correct dungeon. Hey, you two find any clues? No, nothing yet. How about you, Corefish? Any luck? Got nothing here either. Don't let it get you down. There's something here that's kind of interesting. Interesting. There, have a look for yourself. I always find it funny when it's like, what Pokemon could that possibly be? And it's always like a mystery in the games. When, you know, all of us, like, kind of veterans of the series at this point, it's like, yes, that's a Groudon. You can catch it, like, uh, in Pokemon Ruby. You can also catch it in Emerald. It also has a primal form. It spawns the sun when sent into battle. But, like, we've seen it all at this point. It's Pikachu! <laughs> it's in Footprint Runes. Let me read it. Uh, reignite the life that burned within Groudon. What's with the obsession with feet? <laughs> Rome touched the statue of Groudon. Sensing anything. It's just like, it's working on command. What is he feeling? That's it. It's here. It's here. Place the drought stone in Groudon's heart. That lifts the fog. Very well done. Good job, partner. Wait a second. Drought stone? Is that, that maybe. It's a very convenient find that this was just sitting there. <laughs> And no one bothered to pick it up. Put it into this hollow space. Oh. You have unlocked the real rock pass. Sky cleared. Sunlight's harsh. Hey, look. Both of you, up. Look up. Hey, what is that? That's what the fog was hiding. I wonder if no one ever discovered Fogbound Lake. Like, th th this structure is long overdue, just plummeting to the earth. Tell everyone in the guild know. You two go on ahead. Alright, let's move on, Chrome. Onward the Fogbound Lake. Hold it. Oh, you brutes. Good job. You solved the mystery, you're no longer of use to us. Swipe the treasure thanks to you. You fiend, so that's why you joined the expedition. You planned this all along. Expect anything less. Sorry to say it, but I have to get rid of you right here. Oh, uh, wait, wait for me. What? Perfect apple, perfect apple. I finally caught you, my perfect apple. You have a job, don't you, to explore the forest, right? Go on then, off you go. But you don't want to listen to your guild master. Boo, boo, hurry, get exploring. Let's go, Chrome. You think that we should go explore as well? Oh, that's all right. I can't trouble my friends like that. We'll let those two do the these those two do the exploring. Let's wait for their report. Gotham prepare for the noxious gas special combo. La 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 la. No hard feelings. The great famous explorer Wigglytuff is finished. Chemical warfare. We have a bomb. He's been chloroformed. Wigglytuff is gonna break like like wake up in like a dingy basement or something like that. It's like where am I? Your friends? What's wrong? You've been making such scary faces at me. This guy's tough. Really tough. I get it. You're trying to make me laugh with silly faces. I bet I can make you laugh too. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Come on, Chief. I can't take this. This whole weird scene is freaking me out. <laughs> okay, this isn't working. We're out of options. Hey, Wiggly Tough. What is it? What is it? Hey, no hard feelings, but you're going down. Take this. A noxious gas special straight from me and Coffin. 
Um, they they are absolutely dead. Time far up. This place it feels feels strange somehow. The very air is charged with tension, making my skin crawl all over. I feel like I'm being crushed by a terrible sense of danger. Oh, the guildmaster's pissed. Huh? The ground. It's shaken. <laughs> oh no, the guildmaster! He's hangry. Hey, Dad, you hear something right over there? Like moaning and groaning. Oh, you just imagined it. Now let's hurry. Avert your eyes, son. Team is dead. Oh. What is that? Looks like the statue. That Pokemon really exists. You'll never leave here alive, intruders. What? We just want the pill for the treasure. Prepare for my rat. <laughs> Thank God it's a red Pikachu and not Groudon. <laughs> it might be okay, gang. I can't believe he's immediately recovered from the stun. Does he always recover from it? Oh no, he does. Yeah, it's Sleep Seed is the one you want. Sleep Seed is unbelievably powerful in this game. Just look how much damage we're getting in. He's confused and asleep now. Oh, he woke up. He might kill us. But he might not. We're good. Yeah, Sleep Seed is insanely powerful. So strong. Oh! Oh, Groudon vanished. That was not Groudon. That Groudon was nothing more than an illusion that I conjured. Like I said earlier, I'm the guardian here. I cannot allow you the pass. Wait, please. We don't mean to cause any trouble. I came only to get a little information, that's all. Information, you say? I'd be delighted to say that we just made it this far. Please, you simply must believe me. Well, okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Very trustworthy. Well, come on in, then, neighbor! <laughs> I'm Uxi, the guardian of Fogbound Lake, eh? Behold, Fogbound Lake. Wow. Look at that. Oh, very incredible. I would have guessed that a big lake could be high up on this plateau. Look at those fluttering bug Pikachu and blue bug Pikachu. <laughs> this couldn't be more dazzling. Forward for a closer look. Binocular mode engaged <laughs> with that one step. What could that be? I can't figure it out. That's making my heart race. Why? Why should it stir me up so much? Why is my pulse speeding all of a sudden? It's fantastic, but what is that? Oh, it seems so mystical. That is time gear. That is before you have tried to trespass here. I use my grout on illusion to chase most of them off. God, how'd you do that? It's something I create using my psychic abilities. Like so. He's back! <laughs> like, round two. Oh, I almost forgot. You hope to ask yourself, Nuxi. By the way, my friend lost her memories. Did you, did, did they trespass? Are they a criminal? Let me introduce my partner, Chrome. Resident Pokemon, at one time a human. Oh, really, a human? Oh, yes, but Chrome has lost all memory of being a human. So we may ask. You met Chrome here before, Uxie. Did you maybe take away Chrome's memory? The answer is no. No human has ever come here. Explain further. They erase only memories of Fogbound Lake. I cannot fully erase all memories from living beings. I had nothing to do with your friend's memory loss. Or anything to do with your friend's transformation into a Pokemon. Cause lies elsewhere. Oh, well, thanks anyway. <laughs> Crowdon's just like, ah, you still, you still need me here, Uxie, ah. Uh. Wi-Fi signal is kind of faltering a little. Uh, time gear, time gear. Well, too bad. Can't take a time gear. Wigglytuff. Wow, fantastic. Who might this be? Oh, meet our guildmaster. Glad to meet you, friend. Friend, friend, friend. Glad to meet you, friend. Friend, amazing friend. Don't eat me, I'm not tasty. Low to one at all, so what's wrong? Guildmaster. Oh, never mind that. Everyone, look out there. It's spouting. Pretty, pretty. Oh, there's like a volcanic eruption taking place. Lake Geezer erupts every now and then. Sends up water just like a fountain. 
and the time gear sends up illumination from below. Many Ilmus and Volbi glow upon the fountain of water. In harmony, they are the very vision of beauty. Treasure. The treasure must be the view of Fogbound Lake. Groudon's <laughs> Wi-Fi finally went out. Mom turned off the router. Yeah, he's in trouble now. Hang on a minute. Uxie said... Uxie said he didn't know me. Well, if that's true, how did I know about this place? You know, and that a time gear has been stolen. This one must stay safe. Don't ever say a word about this place. I swear it in the name of Wigglytuff's Guild. Please hold true to that promise. I'm taking a major security risk here. Damn, my guy letting like 10 witnesses walk off. What, right, you can't identify the footprint? Oh. What do you mean? I'm trying to tell you, I can't identify what I don't know. Your name is Dusknoir. Oh, please wait just a moment. Dusknoir. The world famous Dusknoir. Thank you for visiting, what an honor. No, no, think nothing of it. The honor is all mine. No greater pleasure than visited Wigglydub's Guild, it's famous. Oh my god, a celebrity. Who's that visitor? You haven't heard of Dusknoir? The famous explorer. Came out of nowhere like a comet. He became famous almost overnight. Today his talents as an explorer are super exceptional. I heard that Wigglydub's guild was met in an expedition to find Fogbound Lake. Came here hoping to hear about your latest triumph. Sorry, we didn't learn a thing. Don't tell them, guys! Shh! Everyone's just like winking to each other. It's like, ah? Ah? Everyone, this is Dusknoir. He's gonna stay in Treasure Town for a while. Mind yourself around him. Dusknoir is very famous and quite knowledgeable. I bet everyone would like to get advice from him. Let's not overdo it. We don't want to be a nuisance. No, if it's autographs you want, I'm sure I can oblige. Hey, you want to get a closer look at my feet, too? Just make sure you recognize them next time I'm here, you know? <laughs> Back on job duty. Uh, we have to help the Applewood gang that's like been under a horrific attack this entire time. <laughs> we also desperately need to clean out our inventory. Okay, we need to blend all these gummies together. This is going to take a little bit. Oh, we got in the discovery. Is there, is there super gambling? New unexplored area was unlocked. Oh, landslide cave. Oh, okay. Rock path's not looking too good. It's so frantic when you're fighting an outlaw. The the most terrifying uh, song in the game we have yet to hear though. Uh, it is for the monster house event, which is quite rare, thankfully, but you'll know, you'll absolutely know it when you get it. Okay. Wanted criminal. Combi. No, it's a Surski. Oh, Exploration Team 1. Run. They're gonna flee. <laughs> Buddy. <laughs> they are putting up a fight. <laughs> okay, they've been blocked by the Beedrill. We got him now. Yeah, we got him. They, like, stole a gummy while they were here, too. Gonna take that for ourselves. You've fallen into my trap. Oh no. Rip and tear, boys. <laughs> We're gonna have to play this carefully. We're kind of lucky with the setup for this. We might be okay. He didn't get the most powerful monster house room that he could have. And like, we're well positioned to. So if you walk into this, it's because you start in the hallway. It's almost impossible to survive. I mean, it's still pretty bad because there's a lot of attacks. Except for this, we're all right now. Um, move failed to impact Chrome. Oh, that's got last resort, Jesus. I think he's got to run down its power points and everything else first. Oh, we're very lucky with that monster. Like, that could have been significantly worse. Yeah, I think we did amazing. There's like four gummies on this floor. Like, Jesus. Gotta be some way we can get back at them. Let's settle for picking on wimps. Oh, hey. Instead of Wigglytuff, how about we take revenge on the wimps in that team search bar? They're just bullies. They, they, ha they are just out to get you for like no almost no reason. No, it is no reason. I just tried to mug you since the start of the game. Oh, there, you're from the guild, if I'm not mistaken. So, Team Search Bar. We work at the guild. We're pleased to meet you. What are you doing in town, Dusknoir, sir? Some shopping. And I was simply enjoying a chat. Held him down. The great Dusknoir is so very famous. Started a conversation. What a surprising talk. The great Dusknoir is so worldly and wise. I'm thoroughly impressed. Marl and Azuro brothers. Well, hello to you both. Hi, Kekleon brothers. Team Search Bar, too. What's up? What's the big rush? Oh, we've been looking for our lost item. You mean the same one you were looking for before? Yes, an item called the Water Float. Water Float, now that's quite the precious item. Oh, we've been looking hard for it for a long time. And someone said they saw a Water Float on the beach today. Rushing to the beach now. 
Juicy tidbit. This will be useful for our plan. Bring the chief up the speed and get the jump on him. Oh god, he's still in Spinder's Cafe. <laughs> you like went away an hour and you just come back and I'm here again. <laughs> like, oh no. How many gummies did he have? Oh, Crumpet's about to level up a bit. We need to get like Thunder Shock or something on Crumpet. She has nothing to her namesake at the moment. Look, she's actually on an adventure. This is the furthest she's gotten. Gonna be hearing the level up sound quite a bit, I think. <laughs> At least you'll catch up. Look at her go. You're doing great, Crumpet. <laughs> oh my god, there's just an Ampharos in this dungeon. That is insane. Ampharos can join. Yeah, that that's actually... I'm amazed that's actually here. Like, no joke, if we got Ampharos... And like, you know, just like, sw swapped out Crumpet here. To her final evolution. Like, we could use her till the end of the game. Okay, oh, even more gummies. <laughs> it's like we're going back to the Spinda Cafe again. <laughs> we will never escape it. <laughs> we're just never gonna leave. Adventurous exploits of Team Search Bar an inspiration to me. Yeah, we actually, we actually got Aerodactyl. Okay, what do we... So this one has to be an old search engine that no one uses anymore. Netscape, that's... I, I think Netscape's old. Netscape is perfect. Another time gear was stolen. Another time gear. Uh, is it maybe the one in Fogbound Lake? No, it wasn't. Stolen time gear was not from Fogbound Lake. Apparently from elsewhere. That's the second time gear to be stolen. Extremely bad if a third were to be taken. Now rest assured, I have full confidence in you all. But I must make one thing very clear. You must never tell anyone what you witnessed during our expedition. Everyone's like pissed that he'd suggest this. Okay, quiet everyone. Sorry to keep you waiting. No further ado, on your marks, get set. Ciao! Let's have a delicious meal! Time has stopped in another part of the continent. Yeah, yeah, that's great, food. Pass, pass me that turkey leg! <laughs> I knew it. I knew I shouldn't have trusted them. Soon after they left, another Pokemon would come. But this one... It stole the time gear! Who could it be? The third time gear. It's got three of the infinity stones! Long Pikachu strikes again. God, Fogbound Lake is okay and no one said anything about it. What? What's going on? It got it. Hold on. You two, Team Search Bar. What's up? You've got yourself some visitors. Visitors? They're waiting at the guild entrance. Go see them. <laughs> How did Grovile beat a sun-boosted adamant 242 attack effort value crowd? <laughs> and like, it even had a choice scarf. Like, there's no way he would have been fast enough. Did you help finding a water float? Water float? Isn't that what you were looking for earlier? Water float. Someone said one was lying on the beach. We went there looking for it. Didn't find it. Instead, this is what we found. Just try to take it from us. We'll wait in the deepest part of Ant Plains. No, no, we can puny you are. But you can't even reach us. Cha ha ha! Make sure you laugh my write my laughter down, okay, in this note. Want to capture my essence? Go get the water float back for you. We will. No more tears. Sorry to body about this, thank you. Ooh. It's always a terrible team. Oh no, Crumpet, watch out. Okay, get to the rear. Keep Crumpet safe. He's in danger. Okay, oh no. No, gang. Oh no. Oh, YouTube. That's really bad. Yeah, I can I can reunite with one of them soon. It's mainly Crumpet I'm worried about. Oh, thank you. I think Crumpet came to us. Edge can hold their own a while. Come on, Cr Crumpet! Crumpet, please! <laughs> Crumpet, please! That wasn't too bad. We get fair we're getting very lucky sometimes with stuff like that. Hello, Dustin, our sir. We're talking about Marrow's lost item. Remember, we discussed that very same thing here not long ago. I have nothing better to do, so I'm just going back to the same shop like three times a day. Though I can't talk, considering I'm like set up camp in the Spinda Cafe. One more thing. Where's Team Search Bar gone? They went to Ant Plains. Pardon? Did you say Ant Plains? Ant Plains at this time of year. It's the season for. No, this is ruinous. Team Search Bar is in grave danger. Must leave for Ant Plains immediately. There he goes. I'm sure we'll be fine. Looks the target enemy with a pause status condition. A Pokemon with the pause status is incapable of action. Uh, does that actually... That actually might be good. Does that stop them from just attacking on that? And if I hit them... They don't do anything. Yeah, that, that seems really valuable. There, the gang's all here. <laughs> An intimidating place. Huh? Over there. That'd be the water float, Chrome. Get a close look. Oh. 
Why did you come here? This is our territory. My name is Manetric. I am. I am the leader of these Electrites. Oh. Now prepare the fight. Uh, it's time for Vacuum Wave to shine. I'm, I'm just gonna spam it until they're dead. Oh god, yeah, be quick. Oh no, Crumpet. That, it doesn't buff their attack at least. <laughs> Firefox is just gonna be like so annoying for anything to deal with now. She's just gonna keep, like, she's just gonna keep constantly inflicted status. Can't move and confused. Oh, that's great. You dare. Wait just a second. We honestly need to come here to make claims of your territory. Enough, take this. Stop! I'm the explorer Dusknoir. Manetric. You have every right to be angry. Especially in light of what your tribe has suffered on these grounds. Hostility toward any that trespass here is natural. This is your haven, a place where you find solace. I understand that completely. I have these unwitting trespassers, I offer the sincerest apology. They entered here unbidden, but did so without malice. They mean no harm. I'll leave you in peace as soon as our errand is complete. Please believe me, Manetric. You know much about us, Dustmar. You make the claim. They mean no harm. I'm gonna fight you anyway. <laughs> like, let's go. I don't get it though. How did this water float end up here? Magic was put there deliberately. Whoever did this knew that you would eventually get to this spot. The fact that Manetric protects its territory is well known. Someone expected a confrontation between you and Manetric. You were set up. Wasn't that your intention, you sneaking scoundrels? By the time you came out of hiding and showed yourselves. Sha ha ha, so you knew all along. No point in hiding then. You know, like Whooper, just not a thought in, in her head. She's just like blank expression, hasn't said a word. Let's skedaddle, boys. Stinkers, I've never forgiven those guys. Certainly are quick when it comes to skedaddling. Afraid our effort will be wasted if we were to give chase now. To deliver the water float to the young brothers. In rescuing Azuril, you were so fast at pinpointing the child's whereabouts. So fast at reaching our young friend too. But the Azuril rescue, I have to admit something. It'd be great if it truly happened the way Kecleon said. It's not exactly the truth. Didn't pin down Azuril's location before we rescued him. Out of here, just happened to see it in a dream. Excuse me, a dream, you say? A dream, what do you mean? Oh, that's right. Maybe the great Dustnar will know what all it means. See, my partner occasionally gets weird dizzy spells when touching something or someone. When my partner sees or hears events that happened in the past, or just about to happen in the future. What? Well, that's. that's. a dimensional scream. Dustnar, sir, you really know about something. You really know something about this. In that case, you ask if Dustnar knows even more. Let's see. You found our friend unconscious right here. Yes, this is the exact spot. And you regain consciousness. But you've lost your memory. Yes, I had a memory of a name. The memory of being a human before this. I beg your pardon. Human! Your friend here seems to be a Pokemon in every obvious way. That's true. He's actually live streaming on Twitch.tv right now. I know, it sounds weird. <laughs> That's not even a good joke. Whoa, wall break! You, uh, you said you know your name, at least. And that name would be... Chrome told the name to Duskmar. I see. You're Chrome. That name ring a bell? No. It means nothing to me, unfortunately. What did I just see? The faintest. Duskmar just hide the faintest of smiles. Did I imagine that? I offer you my full cooperation. Oh, you will. Guess to be perfectly candid. I can't stand knowing that there's something I don't know. But honestly, that is the full truth of it. Hey, look at the Pelipper. Seems to be a lot more flying than usual. Something be the matter. What's the hurry? You're all out of breath. Calls and put out. All the apprentices to report to the guild immediately. Uh-oh, something's up. We'll go with you. Chapter 11, Grovile the Thief. Another time gear was stolen. Another one. From where now? Where was this time get stolen from? It... What's the problem? Did it, ha did it happen somewhere you don't want to talk about? Wait, it wasn't the one from... It was. This time, the time gear from Fogbound Lake was stolen. But how? Time gear was at Fogbound Lake. Only we knew about that, right? Like someone spilled the beans. Wait, there's more. According to Uxie's victim statement, Intruder's identity has been revealed. Wubby! 
Let me go get my shoddy. Who, who are we messing with? Pokemon goes by the name of Grovile. What a nasty piece of work. If, at this point in time, if you were like, if you got Trico as your partner, you'd just be looking at this and you'd be like, Dad? Urgh. A great beast has awoken. Yumta, everyone, we will catch Grovile. Catch that thief. I vowed upon the name of Wigglytuff Skilled. Shout out if you will. Wigglytuff just like punches a hole in the wall. You know what that means? Preparation in Spindus Cafe. Time to get some juice, gang. How many gummies have we got in our inventory? I need to put away my money. Actually, wait, no, I don't I don't want to do that yet. Hang on. We want to do the cheese strat. I want to link together Firefox's moves so that it's Confuse Ray and Imprison together. So those are now linked. So Firefox will instantly use Imprison and instantly use Confuse Ray, which is insane. That just shuts down a Pokemon. It's like actually overpowered combination. It's so good. But we got we gotta try it. Together we've identified several locations where the time gears may be found. Yes, that everyone split into groups and investigate each of these potential sites. Uh, what about me? Diglett will remain at the guild. Can't very well leave the guild completely unattended. Krogan and I are staying behind at the guild too. The work we do at the guild is important too. Make sure we keep up our good work. Like poor Diglett's like, oh gee, I really wanted to go. <laughs> what is Larvitar already available? That would be a really cool one to get. Okay, let's walk next to him just so we have the chance to recruit. Straight up. Straight up. That's actually quite a good one. That's a very good- This could be Bing. This could be our Bing. It's scripted. <laughs> we haven't had Bing yet. We do probably need a water type for the desert. I don't think Crumpet's gonna do too well here. Yep, send Crumpet home. Crumpet was always here. This cheer us on just from the sidelines more than anything. Bing is level 22. Like, Bing's literally the strongest thing we have now. <laughs> That's insane. Wait, they have no attacking moves. Oh no, Bing, you're useless. Oh, please earn an attack and move. That's kind of a rough one. Because that's powerful as well, but that can, like, hit your own Pokemon. I'll try it. Better not kill anyone, Bing. You did it, Bing! <laughs> See anything around here uh, that even remotely looks like a time gear. This is nothing here. Well, what's wrong, Chrome? It's feeling. The one I had it, got at Fogbound Lake. I know this place. Wrong, you seem to be in a daze there. I mean, nothing here, how disappointing. Support our finds to the guild, let's go home. This is being pushed back. <laughs> hey, we went out to the eastern forest just like we were told. Hey, there's nothing really there but the forest. The crystal cave, it was chock full of crystals. Pretty pretty cave, I tell ya. So free, I just couldn't help. Open myself to a crystal. <laughs> he just stole something. <laughs> we all failed to achieve our objective. You had the nerve to collect a souvenir totally unrelated to the mission. Who do you think you are? This is my domain. I am the god of this world. Go to Electivire to fix Bing's moveset, please. Yeah, I will in a mo. Hang on. <laughs> yep, so you can remember moves too. So, remember with Bing. Oh, he's got Rock Slide and Bite. That's amazing. <laughs> he's actually got coverage now. Flinch God, basically. Okay, let's go back. Round two. Oh, we don't have to go through it again. Just back. That's, I mean, that's convenient. You think, where should we look, Chrome? We have to drown in the sand. <laughs> Let's go for it. Let's jump into that quicksand pit. Let's jump, up, jump off a cliff next, Chrome. Let's see how long we can hold our breath underwater. There's a dungeon down there. We gotta try it. Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Immediately die. Can't believe they're dead now. This is just the afterlife. Okay, Bing can actually use moves now. This is shocking development. How are they gonna get out though? One one problem at a time, right? We're we're exploring. And Kata wants to join. I don't think we have one yet. Okay, we need a new browser name. What have we not had? The 3DS browser. <laughs> Perfect, you know, like a classic search engine. Okay, what we got? Oh my god, you just get access to flamethrower like that. That is amazing. I think I just swap Ember out for that. Yeah, Firefox has insane moves. There's arguably only one slot left we need to fill now. Where's the DSi internet browser? We already have the 3DS, but we're not gonna have every variety of DS. <laughs> oh, it's a 3DS XL. The new 2DS. Also because there's like 50 of them. Dan, do you like ham? Sometimes I wonder why people are here. <laughs> what are you getting out of this? I need to know if the Irish streamer on Twitch would approve of like this Sunday roast I'm cooking. He hates ham. <laughs> 
I actually quite like ham. Don't put words into my mouth. I'm a ham man. Actually, what is your favorite ham? I, I, I don't know what you mean now. I don't know. <laughs> like, people are going crazy at like this like small bit of information. Anything I say right now, someone's gonna be upset. If I say, nah, I haven't had ham I haven't had ham for dinner in a while. You know, I like it, but I don't know how much I like it really, if you think about it. I've not had it in a while. I had a good ham sandwich, but that would have been would have been a while ago. Unsubscribing for bad ham opinion. <laughs> Controversial opinion. I'm not a fan of gammon. But you take that back, you sick YouTube! Same kind of light that we saw at Fogbound Lake. That means light may be coming from a time gear. Oh, it went dark. Wait. What, who are you? Who said that? Stay away from the time gear. You won't leave the time gear alone. I'll stop you. Who are you? A mesper. At the deep underground lake, I protect the time gear. I won't allow you to disturb the time gear. Get ready. Just immediate fight. Negotiations are over. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Actually, wait. No, here's the game plan. It's finally time to just use status. Watch this, okay? Can't move, confused. <laughs> oh, we're doing so much damage. Slowed now as well. Th that was so easy. Please listen, we didn't come to steal your time gear, really. But why to me? Because he uses telepathy to tell me what happened. You know, the time gear from Fogbound Lake was stolen. And you heard about it from Uxie. That was your doing, wasn't it? No, it wasn't us. And who's responsible? Would probably be me. Oh, Grovile. It's Grovile. I must apologize. I'll be taking that time gear. Stand aside. I won't. I won't let you take the time gear. You have no choice then. That's for it. You lost that fight. You sustained serious damage. So don't push it. You're not getting by us. Go let you take the time gear. Alright, sorry for this. He's so strong. Shouldn't have insulted Ham. We could have prevented this. He's a gammon man. Oh, this is bad. We have to get out of here. Uh-oh. It's happening. It's happening because the thief took the time gear. The time in this whole area. Time will stop all around Underground Lake. If we don't hurry, we'll be trapped in time. Hurry, run with all your might. They're running very slowly. <laughs> Too bad the opportunity to catch up slipped away. Back to square one. Maybe not unnecessarily. There's some clues. One time gear was at Fogbound Lake guarded by Uxie, correct? Another time gear was at the underground lake guarded by Mesprit. It's believed that Uxie is the being of knowledge, and that Mesprit is the being of emotion. But three Pokemon total represent the spiritual world. And they are said, are said to keep the world in balance. Besides Uxie and Mesprit, there's another Pokemon like them. That's the last of the trio is a Zelf, known as the being of willpower. Uxie and Mesprit both guard time gears. Therefore, a Zelf may likewise be protecting the time gear. Oh, I see. If we could locate a Zelf, we can find a time gear with the Pokemon. And we may have a chance at seeing that thief Grovile appear. Uh, Uxie's lake was located on a high plateau. Mesprit's lake was hidden far beneath a desert. Both cases of the lake were, lakes were in unusual places. The lake where Azelf lives. It'll be somewhere that we, we least expect it to be. Azelf is the being of ham. <laughs> God damn it, guys. This doesn't even happen anymore. Ham pash. Okay, no, just stop. Stop, you've reached, the, you've reached, that's it. You've killed it. You've reached the... The absolute end of this stupid, stupid joke. I have an idea. Doof. What can I do for you? I have a request. That crystal you picked up previously. May I borrow it briefly? It may trigger the dimensional scream. It may trigger a vision. Vision of the future. That's why we wish to borrow the crystal because of Chrome's ability. Please, may we? The doof just says no. Now I'll take it. The time gear. No, you can't take it. Never. Oh, it's not going well. That was Grovile was trying to steal a time gear. There was also another Pokemon. Was it Azelf? Vision indicated the presence of a time gear, which means maybe what we seek is in Crystal Cave. Perhaps there's a passage there that leads to the time gear. Absolutely. There's no other choice. We have to pit our hopes on this. Just thinking, Dust Noir, sir. Yeah, they're gonna be a bit more fearsome. Ah, nah, we have Flamethrower. <laughs> We have Flamethrower. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. Oh, we got Wormadan on the team as well. I don't think we'll ever use this. Yeah, we got another bench one. What are we naming it? Wormaham. <laughs> That's not even a search engine. 
It's not a search engine. This is the only exception. We have to go back to the search engine naming scheme after this, okay? Crystal changes color when you touch it. Crystal cave, shining lake. It's a zelf spirit, it's clear as crystal. Could it be the color of cold water? Absolutely spelling it out. Dangerous chrome, let's back off. Who would have guessed? Big crystal is now here. It's a big jagged open in the middle. Do you think we should go through here? Maybe it leads to the lake where Zelf lives. Those three crystals with a key, Chrome. They open a path that may lead to a time gear. Let's go, Chrome. We're off to a Zelf's lake. Crystal crossing. Water is green now. Oh no! <laughs> okay, we gotta start taking them out. There's a lot of them here, too. Oh no, we're dead. We're, we're absolutely gonna die. Oh no! What do we even do? No, stop! I haven't even got a turn! Okay, quickly, they all turned around to look at our leader. Just... Just use it! We were just gonna die. We were just gonna die. There is no way through that. Stop giving me anxiety. <laughs> I just need you to know what we're up against, right? Don't be a monster ass. No! <laughs> you can just tell. There's too many. There's too many. Oh no. Okay, but this isn't terrible. This is a good starting position. We might be able to hold our own here. Wooper might be in trouble. Get him out of there. Come over, gang. Help with the fight. We've gone so long without getting them, too. And now it's just like two back to back. Grab the gummies and go. Rip and tear, dad. <laughs> like in a game like this. Oh. Oh, that's a good find. Oh. Oh, that's really good to find. Very valuable. I might get rid of vacuum cut, honestly. I don't think this. There's no real situation where I want to use Vacuum Cut, yeah. And we can place Mega Drain later with, like, ground-type coverage. That's a, that's a really good find there. Let's try it out. Let's, uh, let's try it out again. Pretty good. Oh, what's happening there? That's Groval. I have sunk down there. That is the time gear, isn't it? Finding his elf, wasn't it? I must apologize, but I must take that time gear. Wait, hold it, Groval. I know my name. Groval the Thief. I heard from Uxie and Mesprit that you were coming. It would have been better if I just knocked you out directly, but I also thought I could possibly lose. If I set up a failsafe system. You, I mean to have it and I will get it. I need the time gear. Even if it means eliminating you as elf. Hang on, the friendship team is here. We want to test out our new TMs we got. You're absolutely stacked. <laughs> Go and stand aside. You leave me with no choice. I'll knock you out first. Just try to stop me. Initiate the cheese. I will throw in some sleep for good measure, too. <laughs> Every status problem inflicted. Cheese. Oh, uh, yeah, the fight's over. Fight's over. <laughs> the fight's just over. <laughs> Get out of the way. Can't talk, but I won't step aside ever. You refused, and you leave me no choice. Oh, well, Firefox is in serious trouble, but I can't move. Stop! Oh, Dusknar, you're all right, Firefox. Please let me handle this. You, it's been too long. It wasn't easy finding you, Groval. But what was that? The great Dusknar knows Groval. Groval vanished. Plastic Groval, you never intend to fight me at all. There's no escaping me. Vanished too. The guilds just finally caught up like, oh my god, everyone is dead. <laughs> they all died. Everyone, they're awake. Oh. <laughs> like mob them immediately. It's like, no, we're injured. Great, there's now two holes in the bedroom floor. <laughs> like, oh, I just got done fixing that. <laughs>
What the emergency siren? It's about an important announcement for Officer Magnusode. Everyone, please gather at the main square in Treasure Town. You will have a major announcement to make to everyone. I saw Red Vent. <laughs> Rovile failed. Failed to steal a time gear. This one was protected. Isn't that something? The hero saved himself and chased off Grovile. It'll be the great dusk tomorrow right here. Astounded. Here he's such a famous explorer. Grovile is a Pokemon that came here from the future. Future? Dad, what's the future? He has a large bounty on his head. Avoid capture in the future, he fled. And in fleeing, he escaped to this, this, the world of the past. After arriving in this time, Grovile plotted. Till he hit upon an utterly catastrophic plan. His plan was nothing less than... Causing the planet's paralysis. Planet's paralysis? No winds blow. Day never comes. Neither spring nor summer ever comes. It's a world of unrelenting darkness. If the time gears continue to be stolen, this world will end in ruin. That's what would happen. This is bad. Gotta do something. I, too, am a Pokemon from the future. My objective is to capture Grova. It's for that reason that I came from the future. I need to know as much as possible to ensure the capture of Grova. I therefore studied everything I could about this world while in the future. It felt terrible not saying anything. But to be honest, you probably wouldn't have believed me. Keeping silent about my identity. I sincerely apologize. Oh no, please don't apologize. You can't blame yourself. You had no choice. I concur, Dusknoir has done nothing wrong in my book. Focus on our anger on Grovile. I'll somehow capture him. I need to catch him before the world gets ruined. Dusknoir, sir. I'll be glad to help. Me too. I- My golly, me too! Be his Pokemon. Must all work as one. Capture Groval. And put an end to Groval's calamitous plot. Yeah. Get the word out that the three Pokemon, Uxi, Mesprit, and Azelf, spread word that the trio has returned to Shine Lake to seal the time gear away. Please spread the rumor as much as possible. See, so you want word of this to reach Groval's ears. I get it, then when Groval shows up to find Azelf and the others, that's when we catch him. I get it now. Gosh, I'm all fired up with excitement. Arrest, arrest. <laughs> I advise I just want to get someone behind bars soon. I'm afraid Groval will not be lured out by himself and the others that way. But I must apologize. And insist upon capturing Groval by myself. Oh, I see. That's too bad. Terribly sorry, Firefox. This time I hope to capture Groval without any mistakes. Please forgive my selfishness. How it stands, guild members. Better get back on foot, duty. And I'll just say uh, someone's got to keep watching the usual posts. There's more important roles than catching this criminal who's stopping time in this region. Until everything is resolved, we ask that you go about your regular duties. Yes, we would like you to spread the rumor as much as possible. Not so much that it would make Groval suspicious. Try to be natural. Go about your jobs in the usual manner. Like, someone's just gonna be, like, in town hall, just, just crying from the rooftops, like, Did you hear that the lake trio's back there? Alright, everyone, let's have another good day of work. Hooray. Oh, the special episode today's Oh My Gosh has been unlocked. And you get the riveted adventures of Sunflora. Oh, everyone's favorite Pokemon. Sure. <laughs> it randomly warps enemies. Oh, guess what we gotta do again, gang? We have gummies. We receive no information at all, but we are in the dark. That we can't go off on our own and spoil the trap. Stand down until we receive word of some sort. So then we should carry on with our usual work. So everyone, let's get back to work today. We just- we just keep going. Where are the rock pat jobs? <laughs> There's no crime over there, you know, because it's like the perfect society. They don't need our help. Okay, th this is a duck duck go if I ever saw one. This, this has to be a duck duck go. Feel is like a absolute legend. Uh, the problem is the team is full. <laughs> I don't have the heart to replace anyone. I'm just gonna have to go. We're sending them home. We're gonna go with Sveal. We got- oh wait, Duck Duck goes only level 11. Hang on, we shouldn't have taken- okay, right, you're going home too. Hang on. Okay, we'll get- We'll get Edge back soon. Oh, Gastrodon wants to join. That's like actually an evolved Pokemon. Mastodon. <laughs> no, that's not a browser though. It has to be an internet browser. It does fit very well though. We don't have Opera GX. What's that? They're <laughs> just going right up to it. That is a dimensional hole. This is it, isn't that something? Step inside this, we'll take you to the future. If <laughs> Madoof is just going, stay clear. The instant you touch it, you'll be sent to the future. Please be extremely careful. That's Grovile. Looks like a bad guy, that's for sure. Great, they finally caught him. That's right, the world was nearly ruined because of him. Everyone, they would like to share excellent news with you. Finally, Grovile. 
Groval has been captured. But has also delivered a sad piece of news. It's time for me to return to the future. Everyone, I must now bid you farewell. Just knocked in. Oh yes. Before I go, I must see two Pokemon. Firefox and Chrome. That's us, let's go up there. This is really goodbye. Dustnar, sir, for everything you've done. Thank you, sincerely. Well, this is goodbye. Or is it? Pardon? It's too soon for farewells. Oh! You two are coming with me. What the YouTube just happened? Here we go. Only Bing remains. Oh no. We gotta get back to the present day. Chapter 14, Into the Future. I'm sorry to have kept you waiting, Master Dialga. While I encountered more difficulty than anticipated, I finally succeeded. In the capture, yes. I fully understand what must be done. Those who seek to alter the course of history must be removed from history. I will see to the elimination immediately. If we trust up, I can't move. Why is this happening? Oh. I'm glad to see you. You're okay, right? You're clueless about what's what's going to happen. Guess you can afford to be nonchalant about it. Pardon. What came from over there? Grovile. This is a stockade. They're preparing to get rid of us for good. Wait a second. I can understand why they want to get rid of you, Grovile. But why us? I mean, you're on that road. You know, you should be here. But me? Very well, Sableye. Those three, we need to be rid of them. What? Pay him no heed. You may get ready. You too. If you want to get away, give me your full cooperation. To help you, Grovel. There's no time to think. I prefer to stick around for them. They will use claws to strike. Yikes, that sounds scary. That might just op open one avenue for escape. They will unleash their fury swipes in a frenzy. That's our chance. Ridiculously OP move in this game. No, we're gonna die. Like, th that's it. Even one of their attacks where they hit the ropes binding us. Alright, the ropes. Oh, right, the ropes might come loose. Exactly, and if that happens, lash out with an attack and flee. Oh! Endure it. Wait for your chance. You keep going. Be down before our chance comes. Hey! We're breaking the rope. There, attack! Go! There! Thank God I have a flashbang in my pocket! <laughs> Blasted that Grovile, he fled using the flash and that luminous orb as cover. Don't get away with this, come. This is our world, in the future. Those boulders are floating. This is really a strange place. It's horribly dark. And even the wind blows, as if everything stopped. <laughs> Welcome to Ohio. <laughs> exactly. Pardon. I hear those Sableye. You have to keep running. I'm staying on the move. You two should get moving as soon as possible. Good luck. Wait a second. I said to leave soon, but it's dark out now. It's hard to see where we're going. Instead of staying on the move right now, shouldn't we wait for morning? Wouldn't it be better to leave when it gets light out? It is impossible. I hate to say it, but morning never comes. Darkness persists forever. Because the planet has been paralyzed. The planet is paralyzed. The planet's paralysis. That's right, I remember now. <laughs> you sunny day. Problem solved. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> to believe or reject what I'm telling you. Either way, I suggest you leave here as soon as you can. I'm going. Oh, those say, but I catch you. Why is the planet still paralyzed in our future? I don't know who or what to believe anymore. Oh! Sableye! Can't stay here. Let's get ready quickly so we can get going again. They got the gummy bear. Oh, we gotta get back to Spindus Cafe! Main problem is we got ghost types who are now gonna go through the walls themselves. Deal with it. They can be quite hard to get sometimes. As long as we don't get a monster house, we should be okay. The only you can recruit Pokemon from the future as well, unfortunately. Which is really a shame, because there's a lot of cool ghost types here. I can't get them. I, I can't get them. I just gotta throw stones at them. Jesus Christ. Doesn't even give much XP. Like that wasn't even that strong of a Pokemon. It's just the fact that we can't hurt it when it's in the wall. The music, though, the music is great. 
I'm a great time with the soundtrack. It's just a shame that, um, you know, the world is in jeopardy. Everyone at the guild. I wonder how they're doing. The way we disappeared, are they worried about us? We could have chat up a doof and everyone else. I wonder if they're doing well. I miss the guild. I want to see everyone. What is it, Chrome? Let's find Rock Pat, Firefox. And you want us to go after Groval? I want to know something. You want to know something? Oh, I get it. Groval went to our world from here the first time. But Groval should know how to travel to our world. And why, but Dustmar wants to get rid of us. That means the only other Pokemon we know here in the future leaves under Groval. Only Groval. We don't have any choice. Let's pin our hopes on Groval. Okay, Chrome, let's track down Groval. Go Groval and ask him how we can get back to our world. Chrome, thank you. Tried to cheer me up because I was feeling down. Even though you should just be a, just even though you should be just as scared as I am, Chrome. I'm sorry. Even though I have my closest, most precious friend with me, I worried all alone. Almost gave up alone. When in fact I'm not alone. I won't give up anymore. Because you're by my side, I can be brave, Chrome. It's gonna be fine now. Let's keep going, Chrome. Go back to our world. Get her. So sweet, bless. You invade this place with no warning. You disturb our slumber. And without apology, you try to leave. Who's there? Who are you? You dare to anger us. But you to pay for these insults. Where are you? Quit hiding and reveal yourself. You accuse us of hiding. We do not hide. We are... We are here. We are Spiritom. Immediately dies. <laughs> oh, there's Grovel. You too. Grovel, you okay? Stay back. But why? Careful, an enemy lurks nearby. But where? All those who trespass upon this land. None shall be forgiven. None. Not least of all, you. Who is that? Who are you? Pass out of us. Our name is Spiritomb. We are Legion. 108 of them. Careful, you too. That Pokemon is straw. He says 108 of them as if it's like a very particular fact. It's like, not 108. I could handle 107, but that's one too many. Prepare to take your punishment. Okay, it's t it's time for not even the wombo combo. It's just just cast confuse. Okay, and then we just want to switch to flamethrower. We just spam attacks. Not gonna be able to hurt us. Flamethrower does so much. It's so strong. It's already dead. Like, it's winning the fights on its own. Ugh. Yeah. There he goes. Eep. Run away. There he goes. What was that? What was that all about? He got spooked and ran. Grovile. Spiritomb is the ghost of all the Pokemon from Treasure Town, bitter about you and Grovile. No, it's pro probably more accurately, it's it's the spirit of all the other Pokemon in the Spinda Cafe that wanted to gamble, but because we've been there for like five hours, like they're just, they just stayed so long in line and they perished. Like they're pissed at us now. Plants paralysis started with the collapse of Temporal Tower. It was governed by Dialga. Dialga? Who is that? He's a legendary Pokemon that controls time. The Alga ensured the proper flow of time from Temporal Tower. When Temporal Tower collapsed, time gradually got out of control, and eventually the planet fell into paralysis. Time went out of whack, the Alga also lost control. Now here in your future, the planet has become fully paralyzed. And thus the Alga has lost almost all his reason, and is governed by darkness. The Alga is now beyond recognition. He seeks only self-preservation so he prevents history from changing. That's why Dialga wants me gone. Because I tried to change history. I tried to stop the plant's paralysis. I traveled back in time from to your world from this place, your future. What? Grova, you're saying that you came back to our world. So you could prevent the plant's paralysis. That's completely the opposite of what we were told. You've gotta be joking, I was collecting time gears. Because they were needed for prevent the plant's paralysis. I need to take them to tempor Temporal Tower and put them in place. That would have reversed the collapse of Temporal Tower, which is fully underway in your time. After the time gears are put in Temporal Tower, time would have been fully restored to normal everywhere. So you said that was all just a bunch of lies. What else could it be? 
This Death Snarl really is an agent sent from this future by Primal Dialga to get rid of me. Actual Hitman. Grovar, what are you going to do now? I'm going back to the past again to stop the planet's paralysis. Do that. I need to find Celebi. Celebi? That's right. You can come with me or not. It's your choice. You two decide in your own course of action. I'm off. Wide Slash. Who inflicts damage on enemies on the three tiles in front of the user, diagonally and directly in front? Yeah, I, I feel like we should teach this to Chrome. Oh my god, look at the power. That's seven stars. That's insane. Delete Razor Leaf. It has been quite unreliable. Okay, all right, I'll replace this for now. Mega has to go if we get a ground type attack. It'd be nice to get another range move if I can. Sword Stance. Ooh. If I link that with, like, Wide Slash or something. That'd be really powerful. I'm gonna just teach it. I'm gonna I'm gonna pop it on. We can use that with wide slash now. So Mega Drain's gotta go then. Hello, Celebi. Me, Groval. Feel yourself if you're here. Been too long, my dear Groval. Celebi, I need your help again. I know. When you're back here, my dear Groval, it tells me everything I need to know. You're back because you failed in your mission in the past, yes? Yes, it's true. Hope you manage this time. Quite an I've quite had enough of this. Living in this dark and dreary world is so depressing. Sorry, no time to chat. Sable, I are tracking us. If don't leave soon, we'll have brought trouble to you. See, it's quite fine. There's no need to be worried. Let the Sable I come. You have no concern to me. Besides, if you'd be so kind as to prevent the plant's paralysis, you'll finally be spared the agony of this world of darkness. My dear Grova, I will devote my whole life to achieve that end. Master time is on a plateau above this forest. Good, can you guide us? Yes, are all three of you taking the passage of time? Yeah, that's right. This, your friend. What? No. It can't be. Something the matter, Celebi? No, it's nothing. Well then, shall we? Off to the passage of time. Apple woods, but in the future. <laughs> oh no, this is what happens when you pick all the apples. <laughs> It is a desolate place now. <laughs> Stop there, that will do. But that voice. Can't be. Hello to you all. It's been a while. Dusknar. Scurrying carried you far, but sad to say, that's all over now. Oh. That is, that's Primal Dialga. Wrong, Groval. Where's your bravado now? Your Groval. This is it for us. The last time. I traveled back in time to prevent the plant's paralysis. I wasn't alone. It was another. Groval, you didn't come to our world by yourself. Right, I had a partner. We headed to the past together. When you were going through the passage of time, we had trouble. We became separated. The partner should still be back in the world of the past. Even if I am eliminated, my partner will see our mission through to the end. My partner will prevent the plant's paralysis. Ah! 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 Incidentally, what's the name of your partner? Go on, say the name. Why ask such a thing? You can't tell me. No, that's not true. My partner's name is Chrome. My best friend. Groval, did you say Chrome? Well, this is Chrome right here. What? You're Chrome. No, it can't be. It isn't. Chrome I know isn't a Pokemon. Chrome that I know is a human. A good fellow, Groval, that is unmistakably your dear- your friend Chrome. What? Chrome told the name to Dusknar. I see you're Chrome. I just see the faintness. Dusknar hide just the faintest of smiles. Chrome's memory loss was a lucky stroke for me. For all, your partner failed to recognize who I am. Quite easy to win over your partner's trust. It was also easy to drag them to the future when the time came. Groval and Chrome, with the bolt of you here, everything will end when we finally dispose of you. Finally put an end to Groval's glimmer of hope. Everything ends. Everything ends for you. I know. Celebi, can your time travel ability transport us just a short distance into the passage of time? Be easy with the Alga here. The Alga's the temporal Pokemon that controls time itself. If it can make us travel in time, he'll have no trouble exposing it. Even a little will do, please. I'm the travel.
They vanished. Master Dialga. Oh. It's powering up. Dialga is pissed. Not even now you can make it. Now into the passage of time. What about you, Celebi? Don't fret over me. I told you I can't be caught. Stop the plans for houses. Change history. Thanks. Thank you, Celebi. You're not getting away. They just got away. <laughs> Quickly, leave me while I monologue. Chapter 16, a new dawn. Oh, that's right. I'm really confused by a lot of things. Like the whole, this whole concept of time travel. What's that Doctor Who you were talking about? We got a lot to catch up on here. Back to the future. Like, oh, let's have a movie night, gang. Come on. Will I be well received if I go to the guild? After all, I'm a wanna outlaw in this world. If I went to your guild, won't everyone be shocked? Don't you think they tried to capture me? Oh, I know. There's a good place. We'll need to go through Treasure Town. Shouldn't be a problem if we lie low and sneak through. Lead the way. Oh, also, welcome back to this reality. Here's like a text message. You can now play Here Comes Team Charm. Oh. Down here. I lived here before I joined the guild. Go on after you. See, this is a hollow chamber in the face of the cliff. Oh, no one's been here to mess it up. Just to show how little interest there is in this place. It'd be better if we stay here a while. We have like our own apartment now. Like a beach view. Chrome and I, we were jointly investigating the plant's paralysis. Pokemon and human. Paired together. Yeah, and Chrome had or has a special ability like no other. We relied on that special ability to investigate the plant's paralysis. It played a vital part. A special ability, you mean the dimensional scream, don't you? Exactly. The dimensional scream is a drawback. The dimensional scream requires presence of a trusted Pokemon partner. Without that partner, the ability cannot be triggered. Trusted partner. Does the Dimensional Scream only go off in response to, to only Time Gears? Right, the opposite is also true. Dimensional Scream is not triggered in places that aren't connected to Time Gears. Hmm, really? That's not how I remember it. Hey, Chrome. Remember that time it went off near Drowsy? During our first exploration. And there were other times, too. It went to places that seemed to have nothing to do with Time Gears. Even in a place like that, the dimensional screen went off sometimes, didn't it? Perhaps things are just different in this world. Perhaps the nature of the dimensional scream is altered in the past. Azuril is suddenly hella suspicious. <laughs> that wasn't like the Azuril float, that was a time gear. They stole one. After identifying the locations where the time gears would be in the past, we took the passage of time. It brought us from our world in your future to this world. However. Whoa. Are you okay? No, don't let go, just a little longer. Come on, hang on. No, I can't, hold on. We encountered turbulence while we were traveling through time. Thus, Chrome and I became separated. For some reason, Chrome got amnesia and was turned into a Pokemon. I only guess that had something to do with our accident while traveling in time. Came from the future. Just that I came with the mission of preventing the plant's paralysis. Oh no, it seems so outlandish. It doesn't feel real somehow. Chrome, you may not remember any of this, but you're my closest friend. I worried about you when we, we were separated. Glad to see you're safe. Your appearance may have changed, but you've lost your memory. You're still you. None of this alters the fact that you remain my friend. Oh, Chrome, glad to see you again. Firefox isn't here. Maybe outside. What's the matter? Can't sleep. Yep, just thinking. What about Dusknoir? No, that's not it. We're finding out that we were being fooled really hurt. Hearing your story earlier, Groval, made me realize what... But what Dusknor said in the future was really true. It made me understand that Chrome really did come from the future. I was going over things like that in my head. Oh, look, Roval. Sunlight. It's sunrise. It's pretty, isn't it? Yes. Maybe it's because we were in the future for so long. 
I didn't think that a sunrise could ever feel so renewing. The sun rises, then it sets. We take that for granted, and that's only natural. The things we take for granted are really the most essential things, and they're precious. All I'd ever known is the future's world of darkness. Upon coming to this world, seeing the sun for the first time, staggering. Seeing it. Threaten my resolve to turn history away from a future of darkness. Have a look at this. This. What could it be? There's an odd pattern inscribed in it. I've never seen anything like it. The pattern is new to me. It's my relic fragment. It's my personal treasure. I dreamed to one day solve the mystery behind this fragment. I was scared so easily. I didn't even have the courage to apply as an apprentice at the guild. It was when I met Chrome. Chrome was always there to cheer me up, and... There was a time we nearly got, like, crushed to a pulp. It all gave me courage. Chrome, I felt like I could overcome any challenge. How I came to feel over time. But that's why I was able to keep going without giving up. Chrome is lucky. Blessed with a friend like you. Well, it's morning. We should be leaving soon. Yep. Alright, it's agreed. We, we will collect all the time gears first. We have to decide which time gear we should target. Check the wonder map. How about Tree Shroud Forest? That was where I got my first time gear the last time. There was no one like Uxi guarding that time gear. Oh great, we have to fight someone over a time gear that would attract attention. That won't be a problem here, right? Exactly. I just grow my partner while you were gone. I got addicted to gummy milkshakes and they've taken over my life. Groval, we don't have it in the grim, dark future, have you? Ever seen Starbucks? You know what a lottery ticket is, Groval? Oh, we might have just broke the game. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Flicks damage on the target even at a distance using two to five attacks during one turn. It's a gun. <laughs> I haven't actually been using Wide Slash that much, yeah. Oh, but Wide Slash's damage is insane, though. It's like seven. I sh Maybe I should just use it more. It's a lot of power. Do you want to try this? I got so... When that lands, that is amazing. That's so much damage. <laughs> time is at a standstill here. And Uxie and his friends make a promise. They return the time gears to their rightful places. Time remains stopped here. It means the time gears may not have been put back in the rightful places yet. Let's see about that. The forest time gear was over here. The time gear. There's no mistake in it. Time here seems to be stopped. There isn't even a breeze. Well, took the time gear. What are you doing? Time has already stopped here. It won't make any difference if I take the time gear now. Or you go back to Sharpedo Bluff. I'd like you to gather some information in Treasure Town. Yes, here's what I need you to want you to find out. Learn everything you can about what's happening in this world right now. I think I'll go find out. Like, like Firefox is gonna like pop on a hood or something like that. It's like they'll never spot me now. <laughs> yeah, I'm going incognito. <laughs> Uxie and his friends put back the time gears in their original places. Everyone was happy because they thought, thought time would return to normal. But time stayed stopped in those places. Even worse, it's spreading. Time is stopping in more and more places. Only willing to stop the destruction of time now. We need to gather time gears. The time gears must be put in place in Temporal Tower where Dialga lives. There's a problem. Temporal Tower is located in a place called the Hidden Land. As the name suggests, no one knows where the Hidden Land is. Look like the time gears. In the meantime, I want you two to search for the hidden land. Okay, is that okay, Chrome? And you're in charge. Hidden land is supposedly somewhere in this world. Fortunately, there are no clues as to where it is exactly. You think if they find it, it's like, it's now the found land. If the browse somewhere we haven't gone on this internet. Yeah, there's no way we can find the hidden land on our own. We do need everyone's help. We don't get their help. We'll run out of time to prevent the plant's paralysis. And imagine that everyone will be shocked. But... I'm sure they'll understand. Let's go home, Chrome. Back to Wigglytuff's guild. Yeah, they did see us be literally abducted as well. <laughs> Probably a little suspicious of what's going on there. Footprint belongs to. Footprint belongs to. What's wrong, Diglett? Respond, respond. It is Firefox and Chrome too. Diglett, long time no see. Wigglytuff has been awoken. Hey, it's true. Oh my gosh, it really is Chrome and Firefox. Both alive, we were worried so much about you. Boy, do we have a story for you. 
Welcome home. Firefox, Chrome. First, Grovile is actually a good Pokemon. He was collecting the time gears to save the world. Yep. The Great Duskmar only pretended to be kind and helpful. He was actually a heinous and wicked villain. Yep. So I didn't re really phrase it as heinous and wicked. Also, Chrome was really Grovile's partner. Yep. Duskmar wanted to get rid of both Chrome and Grovile. We took them to the future. Yep, and me too. And you managed to escape from Dusknoir by the skin of your teeth. You barely made it back home from the future. Yep. And finally, this planet will soon become paralyzed, and to prevent that, Grovile has started gathering time gears again. Meanwhile, you two are looking for a place called the Hidden Land. Is that your story in its full entirety? Which is like battered and bruised from our adventures. It's like, it's all true. It's all true. Like, incoherent gibbering. Could anybody seriously think of the great Dusknoir as a villain? Hey, remember that evil monologue he gave when he abducted them in town, the town center? What was that all about? Anyway, they're totally lying. Uh, I believe him. What'd you say? Do if you now claim that the Great Dusk Knight is a, is a villain. Oh, and Firefox are more important. And they're still one with my mortal plane. They're still following my church. You gotta respect that. I believe him. You think like Crow Gunk's gonna be? It's like, nah, I ain't buying it. He's full of YouTube. Thank you, everyone. Yeah, Krogunk's staying quiet. He didn't say anything. Thank you for believing us. I suspect that Chatot isn't convinced. Krogunk, meanwhile, just keep your head down. Just keep your head down. Don't draw suspicion. They don't need to know. We don't need to talk politics at the family dinner. They don't, let's just keep it to ourselves. Well, Guildmaster is no fool in you, I admit it. I guess I believe Chrome and Firefox right from the start. Oh, really? Uh, if I would have said that, I believe them right away. Everyone would have just got along with what I said. He's just totally faking it. <laughs> Out of doubt, I was convinced of the get-go. I knew everyone would surely believe their colleagues. Says you. Copium. <laughs> Find the hidden land together. Yum ta. Hooray. Krogunk, meanwhile, just keep your head down. Just get back to the swap shop. You just need to sell. You just need to sell goods here and earn a living to provide. Need to get that pension, just don't say anything. I don't have any information on the hidden land, but maybe the wise Torkoal, the town elder, may know some. Torkoal, the town elder. He's the wise and oldest Pokemon of Treasure Town. He loves the hot spring, so he's always there. I'm positive that you'll find him at the hot spring. Yes, let's all focus our efforts on the hidden land. Except you, Diglett. Keep looking at people's feet. We need to learn more about feet. There are types of feet in this world we haven't learned about. I can finally... Oh, these guys are dead, aren't they? We haven't seen them in a while. Sword Sands the Bullet Seed, there we go. Stranding the link here. You do a nice scary face brick break. <laughs> sure. And how many gummies have we got? <laughs> yes! Let's take as many as we can carry. Campbell's back on the menu, boys. That's why we gotta hold on to this world. We can't let the future get dark. We need our casino slots. Okay, it's finally time. And so long. From our real home in this world. The world is ended as the Tower of Falls protagonist is gambling time. <laughs> but the world's ending. Oh, give me like 12 shots of tequila in the bar. Like, that's our, that's our reaction to like this inevitable demise. I see the hidden land, you say. I have heard of it. Oh, really? Hidden land is truly a place of legend. It is, it is tattered lore at best, handed down by oral tradition. No matter, please tell us. Of course, I can tell you only what I have heard. The hidden land lies beyond the sea. In a hidden place, so the story goes. The hidden land allows only the chosen to find it. To go there, one must possess certain qualities. It's only someone with pro proper qualifications can go to. Hey, Torkoal, what are those qualifications? They are... Uh... No, uh, what were they? <laughs> oh, that's it! You need proof. You need proof of some sort. Yes, that was it. Proof. Proof, what kind of proof? That would be... Uh... Forgive me, I've forgotten again. <laughs> Sorry to disappoint you. The world ends. Time has stopped. We spoke of travel to the Hidden Land yesterday. I said that you need a proof of your qualification to go there. I remembered a bit about... A bit more about that proof. The proof. There's an inscription of a certain pattern. A certain pattern. What kind, of, what kind of pattern would that be? Uh, how can I describe it? It's difficult to describe. I tell you, the pattern is quite intricate and odd. Feel your pattern, the kind of pattern you rarely see. Excuse me, could you have a look at this, please? Oh, this is it! It's a pattern exactly like this! Where did you get this? 
Can't say if I even remember where. Just happened to pick it up. Everyone, please listen. I once saw the same pattern deep inside a place called Brian Cave. I think we can discover more by taking the, the relic fragment there. However, there is one problem. Pokemon lurks there who is a vicious bandit. The place is challenging. Everyone should take some time today to get ready. Set up for Brian Cave tomorrow. Thank you, Torkoal. It was nothing. We're gonna get, like, have a rescue request later. It's like, I got stuck in the dungeon. <laughs> Another thing. Something I need to do, so I have to go out. You're in charge while I'm gone. As you wish. You two will be with me tomorrow. As such, Team Search Bar's non-guild members may not come along. <laughs> I don't like these other losers you have in your team, alright? You gotta be like my entourage here. I want to be young again. If I was younger, I'd certainly join the challenge to find the hidden land. Whoa, hold it there, old-timer. Who is it? Oh, they've been gone a while. What is it? What do you want? Over Team Skull. The business with Wiggly Love's Guild, old-timer. I heard you say something that sounded fun. What about the hidden land? He's being mugged again. <laughs> old-timer, why don't we take this chat somewhere where we won't be disturbed? Hey. No, Peepaw's getting mugged. <laughs> Chapter 18. Lapras. That. What is that? Oh. She goes. It's Nord VPN. It's going to help us change regions. Of course. We need to get across the sea. But our internet browsing is located on this continent. Thanks to the power of Nord. <laughs> and this video sponsor will find the hidden land. No, it's Surfshark. <laughs> does fit. That does fit better, yes. You got the goods. <laughs> I really appreciate the promise you made and upheld for all this time. No problem, no big deal. But today, I'm here to see you about that promise. We find ourselves in a situation where we can't afford to uphold that promise. I suspect that you know why. Please tell me about that strange pattern we once saw. He's meeting his apple dealer. <laughs> you got the good stuff. <laughs> Deep in this cave that we saw the peculiar pattern. It was dead, however, this tough Pokemon appeared. I recall it getting slammed with water, like a tidal wave. I mean, water type moves. We're a ground type, we don't like water at all. We don't have to fight enemies like that. Like, Doug Drio's just like, oh no, we're not making it. We don't have a lot of good type diversity in the guild, do we? Just actually looking at the ensemble. Like, psychic water, normal, more normal, ground, one grass. Like, we're, mi we're missing a lot of coverage. Krogunk, I'm convinced, doesn't even fight, so I wouldn't even count his types. He's just here. Oh. Whoops, excuse me. Hey. Long time, weaklings. Oh, you're that nice team, eh? This is it, the relic fragment. That's... Oh, I'll take this. Fe like, the fate of the world is at stake. Oh, your demeanor and language seems to be much coarser now. Shout out, they were fooling the guild all this time. The bad exploration team. Team school is a bunch of crooks. What is that true? But oh, what else? Have to be naive beyond belief to be fooled this long. Quickly, I, uh, take out our machine gun. We, we, we can solve this real quick. They won't get away with this. I'll show them what it means to trifle with me. Oh wait, chat out. He's gone. We should, we should probably hurry too. Yeah, he's gonna be dead soon if we're not careful here. Oh, we got like one of the unique room layouts. Look at this. I don't think we can get it, but look, like, if you have like a water Pokemon. Hi highly sought after for times like this, because there's just an island of treasure. It's a real shame we don't have one. I love when I had Piplup in this game because I could just walk over there and grab everything. Oh, it's Team Skull. What happened to you? Wait, it can't be. Were you attacked by a mysterious gang of enemies? Oh, you knew it was coming. It would have been good to know that. Not that you'd tell us. Chowder came along after we uh, we got wiped out. He spotted us down and out. Skull us all sorts of choice words. He'd given us that blister and tongue lash and he went on his way. As he said about us, I'm still seeing red. I'm so steaming mad I refuse to give up here. <laughs> Getting out of here if I have to crawl so I can deliver my payback to that blasted chat -off. Bad to you two all this time. You went through downright rotten times because of us. But you two can still bring yourself to worry about the likes of us. Yeah, the relic fragment. Oops, how unlike me. The relic fragment slipped out of my grip. I can't move yet. Firefox is gonna steal it back. Oh, like, oh no! We're worrying about Chatot instead. So, right, where did Chatot go? He went deeper, he's going after those enemies. To hurry up and go to. Two. Oh! Axe 
actual horror game now. Firefox, right, grow and be careful, they're above us. I'm Kaboot Ops. The Omastar Brothers. All trespassers need to be taught a lesson. Take that. Oh. Chat hot. Chat hot. Your turn next. Take this. Okay, alright. Let, let. <laughs> How ridiculously powerful can we make this? Okay, sword stats, bullet C. Let's go. Well, that's one dealt with. That's two. They weren't even that strong. Guildmaster. Alright, Grovile. What's Grovile doing with the Guildmaster? I'll explain later, this is more important. Chat off. Last time we came here, you were knocked out right away, child, so you probably don't remember this, but that time, Budo's gang sprang at us. Shielded me from attack, chat off. The Kabudos gang packing right after that, but if you were jumping out to shield me, chat I would have been knocked out on the spot. I owe my life to chat out. That's what happened. Chat out, you are my invaluable partner. Privilege to hear such words, Guildmaster. A happy Pokemon. Oh, still has time. Get him back to the guild now. Like, why, why aren't we using the reviver seeds right about now, gang? You three must keep going. But don't worry about it. Besides, we don't go on from here. God's shield and you will have been for nothing. Oh, the relic fragment. The pattern on the wall is glowing now. It's as if it's reacting to the relic fragment. Beam of light shot out to sea. What's that out there? What that's... Firefox, Chrome, and Grovile, correct? And Lapras, and the guide to the hidden land. You're what? You can take us there! You unleash the beam of light from the pattern on the wall. It's a signal for gaining entry to the hidden land. It is beyond the sea. Step onto my back. I will carry you across the sea. Chapter 19 to the hidden land. Now his chat will be alright. Yep, he needs to sleep and recover tonight. I think he'll be fine tomorrow. Okay, I'm glad to hear that. He's not gonna die. I was in a panic because I couldn't help Chathot. It was when Lapras appeared. Yep, Lapras. Lapras saved Chathot. I think Lapras recognized that we were an exploration team right away. So he said to us, he couldn't tell if we were bandits with big ambitions, we were an exploration team with good intentions. So he asked for the sake of the world's peace, we please not investigate the peculiar pattern there. That's what he asked of us. Why didn't you want anyone to investigate the pattern? In the hidden land. This temporal tower where Dialga reigns. Dialga feared intruders to wreak havoc at the tower that regulates time. Dialga decided to protect temporal tower. He hid the hidden land in a gap in time. No one could ever hope to go to such a place. No, Dialga left one key for entering the hidden land. It's a special fragment with a mysterious power etched into it. And why did it choose Firefox? Why had Team Skull able to steal it so easily for so long? I don't really know. The Alga wants to prevent those with bad intentions in their hearts from entering Temporal Tower. That's why the important thing is the purity of heart. Firefox's heart must have resonated with the Relic Fragment. Anyway, we can do no more to help. From now on, this burden belongs to Firefox and Chrome. This team search bears weight. The bear now. We will search for the truth to fix this world. Lapras, what is that? The edge of the gap in time. As the portal through which we will go to the hidden land. Okay, here we go. We got flight! <laughs> wow, Lapras! Lapras is flying! No, that's not it. This. This isn't flying. We're crossing the sea of time. Lapras, is that it? Is that the hidden land? That's the hidden land. We're going in.
we are the explorers of sky. My god, it all comes back. This is the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. That place seems to be floating in the sky. How are we supposed to get there? We must take the Rainbow Stone ship. Far ahead, you will find the old ruins. Here you find an ancient mystical, ves mystical vessel. Rainbow Stone ship. We'll take you to te Temporal Tower. Thank you, Lapras. This is the extent of what I can do for you. Here, you're on your own. Good luck for reaching the Temporal Tower. Oh, YouTube! We forgot to go to the cafe one more time, hang on! <laughs> no, okay, we're not gonna head back, because that will kind of obliterate the game's pace and, uh, like, emotional moments here. <laughs> Let's, let's not let's not go back. Choose rock fat. There's still time. There's still time, please. Oh, we're gonna continue on. Uh, the enemies are gonna about to get significantly harder for these zones too. Granted, we do have our machine gun, which is gonna make quick work of quite a few of them. Oh my god, that's a goddamn Dragonite. Oh my god as well. Emperor Jesus, thank you for the 5,500 bits. Here are the rest of my funds, Dad. Please use them and gamble. It's the only way to stop the disruption of time. <laughs> so he's like, you have to go back. You must. <laughs> a stone tablet. There needs to be something inscribed here. What are these? These strange runes. Inscribed with unknown letters. Written in an ancient language. And read that, Groval. I have research extensively to learn about this. Firefox, this is where it goes. Put that fragment with, in with the strange pattern on it into the indentation. It's quite enough of that. Who's there? Sableye. He's back. Dusknoir, how did you get here? Quite simple, actually. When Master Dialga Warp is here directly. After all, I knew that you would inevitably come here. But you nearly spared us the bother of having to search for you. Firefox and Chrome. I'm with you. Oh well, you display some feeble resistance knowing that it is futile. Simply defeat you here, then take you to the future. It makes no difference to me. The odds are overwhelmingly stacked against you. How much resistance can you even serve up? Show me. Swarm them. Here he comes. We are we already know what the plan is. Oh god. <laughs> Should probably throw the stun seat. Or I was just gonna leave a while. Oh, God, we were like being battered by them. Recover a bit. Oh, we should be all right from here, yeah. There we go. Got through them all. Does our force just to watch his squad get smushed, basically. Oh, that actually took, he actually took a lot of damage to bring him down. Is there that he had bodyguards as well? Aye. 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 I refuse to lose. So foolhardy. You dared to challenge me. For all the effort in the world. With your puny power. You have no chance of winning from the start. Wait a second, the mountain is stomach. That's it. This could work. What is it, Chrome? What? Of course, a combined moves down his stomach. Is that possible? Thank God he's winding up quite a bit here. There's no time, it's our one shot. Take this. Let's go. Thank God for tennis. Sable, I ran off. I just have no luck attracting reliable allies. Firefox. Go to the top of the temple. Put the relic fragment in the hollow spot. I want you to check if the rainbow stone ship actually works. You know, Chrome and I will keep an eye on Dusknoir here. Yo, go do that. If history has changed. We Pokemon of the future will disappear. What if history has changed? Pokemon will disappear. It won't just be me. Both of you. Roval and Chrome alike. As you come from a future that will cease to exist, you will both disappear too. Is that what you really want? Bring peace to this world. We have to disappear. Try to understand, Chrome. That's how it was. I came to this world with such a resolve. Knowing that we succeeded, we would disappear. But if we don't act, the destruction of time can't be stopped. That means we have to do it. Even if that means I must disappear. 
crumb, but it's just one thing. One thing changed for us by coming to this world. It's true we had the resolve to complete our mission. It was true when we first came back to this world. We had absolutely nothing to lose. Nothing to go back to. Chrome, this changed for you when you became a Pokemon. You found a friend and partner in Firefox. Firefox looks up to you. Your partner found out that you might disappear. I'm sure Firefox would be crushed. Firefox is a good spirit, but... The future is altered and you disappear. Your partner will. Firefox will. Be left all alone. You disappear, Firefox will be... Firefox will crash. No! It moved! It moved! Ugh. Ugh. I won't. You'll never change history. Ah! Groval. You shielded Chrome, Groval. It's taking a heavy toll on you. Very well. You're going down first. Oh! What are you doing? Dusnar, I'm taking you with me. We're going back to the future. Chrome, it's up to you now. Those are time gears. Okay, team. Rainbow Stone Ship set to go. What? What's happening? Firefox, this is it for me. I'm taking Dustnar back to the future. Huh? What? Never come back here again. Watch Chrome's back. Promise me. But, take your place, Grova. I can't. You must and you will. You can, Firefox. You two are the greatest of combinations. Hand me. Release me. Chrome's there. Quiet. Chrome. Take care, Chrome. I was lucky to have known you. But the parrot hurts. The rest is in your hands. Sorry for the hold up, Dusk Noir. Grovile. Sad. I don't want to go. Too upset. But. Right, if we don't hurry. Don't hurry, the stone ship might just leave without us. Grovile. It's sad, but right now. We should go. Time gears. Time gears. I better gather them up. Wait for us in the future, Grovile. We'll stop the plant's paralysis. We'll change the future into a better world. A world in which Grovile can live happily. We won't fail, but what Dustnar said... This is what you want if history has changed. Pokemon of the future will disappear. That's right. The future has changed, Grovile will disappear, and... I will disappear too. Say, Chrome. Last thing Groval said to you, Chrome. Pirate and Hurts, the rest is in your hands. His last words, Pirate and Hurts. I understand that feeling, I understand how it hurts. Groval was partners with you for a long time, Chrome. You must have hurt Groval terribly to leave you. It may be what he meant, but no, that isn't it. Groval's last words. They weren't about me and Groval. You meant me and Firefox. Groval said what he did because he knew that I would have to leave Firefox eventually. My time together with Firefox is ending. This is our last adventure. Final chapter. The last adventure. It hits so hard with the music. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, look at that! Temporal Tower! Finally, we're on our way. We're going there. The top of Temporal Tower is glowing red. Why is that? Let's hurry. This is... This is the entrance to Temporal Tower. Ground's shaking. It fell down. What was that tremor anyway? Well, it reminds me. Grovile once said something about this. 
after the time started going out of control everywhere because Temporal Tower began collapsing. The tremor we just felt. Temporal Tower could be falling apart even as we speak. Hurry, Chrome. Okay, it's time to go out on the items. This is it. We, we, t we take everything we need. Guess we're ready. Let's go. Okay, final dungeon. Oh, God, they're really just gonna chuck a lot at us already. This is good, because I can line them up. Get a bolt. I had a little overkill. A little overkill. We got him. Oh, do not be a monster house. Alright. Keep panicking. Like If I see like even like three items on the ground, I'm like, that's it. <laughs> it's here. Deathly afraid of these guys. Got him. Oh. Yeah, this is why. This is... Okay, yeah, just... He's gotta go. This charge is lethal in this dungeon. Especially if you get a few Pokemon spamming it. We know we're safe. There's a few Porygons in here. This is a. Uh, this is time to use something. This slows them down a bit. Gives us a little bit of security fighting them. It's mainly the double Porygons that are fearsome. We're just beelining for stairs here. Oh, good lord. Just take out the Porygon. Oh my... Actually scary Pokemon. Like, they can do a lot of damage. Total lives on his floor 10. It's not a monster house. It's not a monster house. That's actually shocking. I'm genuinely shocked. That would have been like the worst kind of monster house there too. Like it was such a big open room. Temporal pinnacle. Big circular pattern. Inside are indentations that look like they've been gouged out. What is this? Wait a second, the gouger indentations. There are five and all. That means. Oh! So it's you. Seek the destruction of Temporal Tower. But that's not true. We can prevent time from stopping. I'm stopping. Time. Galga. You, you dare bring ruin to the tower. No, that's not it. We came to prevent the tower from breaking apart. Silence for all those threatened temporal tower. I will show no mercy. How many seeds can we spam immediately? Violent seed. Hang on, and then we toss the sleep seed. Sword stance. <laughs> There's several hundred damage. You use a quick orb. Oh god! god. <laughs> We can heal up a little bit. Oh my god, he's just waking up immediately and killing us. It's okay, we have like five more reviver seeds. This is what they're for. Let's keep spamming it. Inventory of reviver seeds cannot be stopped. Oh. Tremor is the strongest so far. Pearl Tower is to be near a total collapse if that were to happen. The structure will accelerate until the planet is fully paralyzed. Gotta hurry. We're in place. Oh! Can't be. Was I too late? Temporal Tower keep on breaking apart. Is it too late to stop the planet's paralysis? Oh! Where? Firefox. Just severely injured. Thank God for that. You have no cause for alarm. I have regained my reason. What? Royal Tower has taken heavy damage. 
it has survived. Now observe. We ate a few more reviver seeds. That's how we lived it. <laughs> this is... Yaga must be showing this to us. This must be Tree Shroud Forest. But it's not the same. We were in Tree Shroud Forest. Time was stopped. Time is... Time is moving again. Temporal Tower. Correct all over. But it's still standing. Temporal Tower didn't break apart. It survived. Temporal Tower survived the crisis. Time has returned to normal here. Thus time has resumed in places where it had stopped. Because you stopped the ruin of Temporal Tower. The planet's paralysis has been prevented. The world's peace! I don't know why I'm screaming this at you! <laughs> it's been restored! Really? We did it, Crow. We finally did it. We brought peace to the world. Allow me to thank you. Thank you for reaching the Hidden Land. With the courage to stand up to me even as I rage out of control. And prevent the ruin of Temporal Tower in the nick of time. Thank you. All this I owe to you. Let's go home, Chrome. Back to Treasure Town. It's time to get the repairmen in. <laughs> in all caps. What's wrong, Chrome? Let's hurry. Body feels heavy. What's wrong? Why am I struggling to move? It's like my legs are weighed down. Maybe now that we change the future, my own disappearance is drawn near. This, this light. All right. Finally, time has finally arrived. Time with Firefox ends now. Hey, Chrome. Huh, Chrome? What is it? What's happening to you? Sorry, Firefox. I kept this to myself for a long time. Looks like I have to say goodbye. Well, goodbye? What are you saying? The listener told me. Change the future, the Pokemon from the future would disappear. That's why I'm destined to disappear too. Huh? What? Why? Why? I don't understand. Thank you for everything. I'm gonna disappear from here now. The Firefox, I'll never forget you. Wait a second, I managed to make it this far only because you were with me, Chrome. Don't you understand? You made me strong, Chrome. You go, Chrome, I... I don't know. What would I? No, Firefox, you have to be strong on your own. You have to live. You have to go home. Tell everyone about what happened here. So that... Nothing like this ever happens again. Chrome. light. The light is getting brighter. Don't, Chrome. Don't. Don't go. Thank you for everything, Firefox. Glad we got the train together at the guild. Glad we got the go on adventures together. I'm glad I got to know you, Firefox. Wait, Chrome. Sorry. So lucky that you were my friend. You're the same Chrome to me, Chrome. You're... More important than anything. Yes, I feel the same way. Firefox, even after I disappear from here, I will never forget you. Oh, Jesus. I have to live. I have to get home alive. Get home and tell everyone about what happened. Because it's Chrome's last wish. There's... There's the Rainbow Stone ship.
little tower is getting farther and farther away. Chrome. I'm getting farther away from Chrome. Oh, Chrome. So Chrome and Firefox finally succeed in their mission. Save the world from disaster. Firefox departed from Temporal Tower. Traveled across the ravaged hidden land. Lapras across the sea. Safely returned the treasure town. Easy clap, Firefox uses shut up. Chrome's been uninstalled! Like, don't ruin it! Don't ruin it! Firefox told the story whenever and wherever possible. As many Pokemon as possible. The story that had to be told. The story of hope for world peace. The story of hope for future peace. A months passed. Treasure Town returned to its cheerful routines. The scars from the plant's injuries slowly healed. And life gradually returned to normal. Oh, howdy, Firefox. Going out? Yep, out for a walk. Sounds nice. Yep, yep. Dinner time soon, though. You don't want to be late for that. Yep, I hear you. Thanks, God. Wow, this is so pretty. I haven't seen this for a long time. It's as pretty as I remember. I'm too busy to come and see it. But I've missed this. Fantastic sight. When was the last time I saw this, anyway? Last time was... Oh. Last time I saw this was when... When I met Chrome. Someone's collapsing the sand. Ah, are you okay? One day I'm sure I'll solve the secret of my relic fragment. That's my dream. If it ever came true, I'd surely faint from sheer happiness. I'm scared. Time to be brave. I need to stand up for this. You can't just run away now, Chrome. Breaking the rope. Now attack. Go. Rome, thank you. Try to cheer me up because I was feeling down. We always do our best, Chrome. Go for it. Let's jump that quicksand bit. <laughs> There's gonna be another flashback where it's like, Chrome, we've already had like 20 shots of the juice from the Spinda Cafe, please. No, Chrome, we don't need the gamble right now! The planet's gonna be paralyzed! I remember it all so fondly. All those memories of my time with Chrome. Memories of Chrome. But now, Chrome is gone. Chrome isn't here anymore. Ah, uh, Firefox! You've been gone so long I took to worrying about you. What's the matter? Bidoof, Bidoof. Oh, Firefox. What is up? What all is the matter? Staff credits. <laughs> they just. Toss it on you! Yeah, that is the main story of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky. As a kid, like, playing this, like, this emotionally destroys you. <laughs> like, no joke. Like, it hits so hard. The music is what carries it. Because it's a very simple story. You know, I, you know, it's Pokemon characters, for God's sake, you know? 
it shouldn't really be as hard hitting as it is, but it works. Like I was tearing up a bit even just playing that. Like I was trying to like keep it together. Like, that really got to me. I'm gonna fucking ball in episode five. Like I'm, I'm not gonna be able to hold it back then. Firefox. My caps lock is stuck again. <laughs> Your sorrow. I felt its intensity even here. And that is how you feel even now. If Chrome were to share those feelings, I will grant your wish. The world needs you both. That is why I will trust you with a gift. I leave to you the future. This is my thanks. Please accept it. Reinstall in Chrome. The end.